won Oscars for portraying two more different people. That's so true. One of us playing a brash and controversial leader, known for loving whiskey, Yo. And always being enshrouded in that hey. trademark. Uh, I wonder if they'll be able to hear you, you over at the show. stream. I'm trying to listen to you uh, and the Oscars at the same time. Huh. By an actor in a All right, role. let's fuck with this. Gary Oldman's also a manly. Actress in leading role, or actor in leading role. Actor. Actor. People Here we go. Burned to death by those All right, who did I put up? Let's see here. To kiss those on the cheek. So pretty, please. Who did we All right, put? I put Bradley Coopsy for uh, Star is Born. Would you have let go forward? Okay, who did... Uh... Uh, Florian went for Green Book. I went for William Defoe because of Spider Man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, hero. Who do you think's actually gonna win? Uh, I don't know. Now that I've seen Green Book, I kind of say it's not gonna be. Bradley Wait, Cooper. you saw Green Book too? No, no, no. I'm sorry. Now that I saw Star Is Born, oh. I want to say it's not gonna be Bradley Cooper. Actually, it wouldn't surprise me if it's fucking Vigo. Uh, the clips that they've showed, it, it seemed like he was doing a very one-note performance. Yeah. Fucking uh, Bradley Cooper got some top-tier uh, mumbling advice from <laughs> Jeff Bridges, I guess, <laughs> for that movie. An invisible being. I feel it. I, I don't see Nobody it. has seen this movie, Willem. No, I, I had a chance to see it, and I didn't, didn't do it. <laughs> I should have. I really wanted to. I love Willem Dafoe, and I love uh, Vincent Van Gogh. If it's fucking Rami Malek, I'm even going to be pissed about that shit. Why? I thought Rami deserved it, right? He did a good job. Yeah. But I don't know if he's better than, like, Are you going to tell me the that here. the Academy thinks Bohemian Rhapsody's editing was better than his performance? It's, it's fucking insane that <laughs> that movie got editing. I am so fucking pissed. I think, I think it'll be Rami because Rami won the Golden Globe, right? Yeah, he did. But I mean, I don't know. Wow. All right. What a racist. How could you possibly give a racist this award? Oh my God, he's a manlet. Oh, damn Rami it. Malek! Damn it, damn it, damn That's it. too bad. Christian Bale should have got it. Well, did, oh, did none man. of us pick Rami? Did nobody none win that one? None of us picked Rami. Shit. Shit. Wow. If Rami I, if, Malek If I could redo fucking... my meme answers. That could have been Sasha Baron Cohen. Yeah, That's holy shit. That's fucking bullshit. Look, dude, I love Rami Malek. He's so fucking good in, uh, uh... What's that show called that he's on? I don't know. Like uh, the oh. hacker show. Uh, Mr. Robot. Mr. Robot. <laughs> I love Mr. Robot. Yeah, clearly, because you know the title. My yeah. In here somewhere. Why do God we have more people it. watching this than any of my other streams? Wow. They're reacting people to us the Oscars. react to a people TV show. People love the Oscars now, monkey. I think there might be more people watching our stream of the Oscars than the actual yeah, Oscars. The Oscars themselves, <laughs> yeah. right. Is there really not a new Avengers trailer today? Was I lied to? Yeah, man. Reddit's full of shit. This is fucking bullshit. I wanted to live stream this, folks, because in the event that Black Panther does win Best oh, Picture, I, I wanted my reaction to be caught on camera. <laughs> Time to have Mr. Robot end early because he's going into movies. So wait, how many more fucking categories do we have? It's got to be best actress. Best actress. And what then, else? And then best picture. Really? Yeah. We're almost done. Shit. All right. Yeah, when you don't have a host, you can actually get done yeah. in three hours. Yeah. Right. Shit. Um. So I fucking won already. Then right? Yeah. Yeah. We we can't catch up. <laughs> <laughs> we only have one point each. You have like five. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. I don't know. Best save save the celebrating like for the 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 podcast. Best picture for, should count for four points. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I make that argument now, but then I might. I You're might making an argument only so that you can lose. You really are a cuck. For Black Panther. 
I think if Black Panther no, wins, it should count I, as 10 no. points. If Black Panther wins, I deserve to lose. <laughs> yeah, Drew. I think Black Panther should be worth a three-fifths points. What, what do you say? <laughs> Does that make any sense? You, you, you take three out of five of my points. <laughs> wow. What, what a compromise. <laughs> three-fifths compromise. Google that uh, one, kids. Yeah. Funny moment in American history. So Bohemian Rhapsody now has more Oscars than Black Panther. Those are the two that are really going neck and neck. I think it's like four to three or five to three now. Yeah. I, well, I think Bohemian Rhapsody is now above it, right? Yeah, yeah. Because Black Panther only has the three, right? I think. Erich wins the coveted Mr. Kino 2019. Last time someone with a competition monkey held, they got arrested. Wow. Did Asperger win a competition and get what arrested the for it? I don't know. Okay, Rami, we get it. You put on fake teeth and did a silly accent and touched yeah. the man's hand. Did he actually Fucking perform like, the songs in the movie? You're the heart of this film. Only some of the time, I think. Uh, other times they were lip syncing? Yeah, I think they mixed in some of the rest uh, stuff. Kind of yeah, I mean, guys, I don't know. Rami Malek is great, but... Mm. Christian Bale! Every, everything about that fucking movie pisses me off. Christian Bale gained 80 pounds for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> and who do you think is going to win best? Actress! Who, who, Actress. Who, who did we all put? I don't even remember what I put. I don't know. I put Olivia Coleman. For okay. the favorite. We have uh, Florian for Glenn Close, and I said Melissa mm -hmm. McCarthy. Not for Jesus her Christ, dude. Not for her There's performance no in Will McCarthy You wins. Ever Forgive Me, but for her There's performance no in The Happy Time Murders, I think was my oh, reasoning. Oh, right, right. Yeah. She deserves the win because of that other movie. Oh, my God. Roma has won almost fucking nothing. Just what, it won Best Best Foreign Film, you rich? And, and foreign film. Which Fuck. means it might win Best okay. Film overall, too. I don't know, it's man. There's, so, like, there's only two or three right choices for this year for Best Picture. That's racist. And I really think that... Oh, God. They're not going to do it. They're not going to give it to someone that deserves it. Fuck. What What would you say deserves Fuck. it? What What deserves it this year? Well, I mean, Black I would Klansman, say... Roma, you said? Roma deserves it. Okay. And, uh, what wait, about wait, what RGB? Was, the favorite. The RBG. favorite. I, I wouldn't mind being... I didn't see fucking R RBG. It's also not nominated. Good. Yeah. What do you mean, good? <laughs> well, good that I didn't think it was nominated. Oh, okay. Um, uh, I, like, I don't think Black Klansman was the best picture of the year, but... E-Rich! I'd rather, I'd rather that win over Green Book or Black Panther. E-Rich! If you're gonna do the... Give it to that diversity movie then definitely do uh, you, you don't think green book deserves the diversity card since it was written by three white guys <laughs> <laughs> that movie about uh what it's like to be a black guy in america <laughs> written yeah. by those three white guys who made up the black guy's true life story and his family disavowed the whole movie so far the correct choices tonight have been spider-verse winning animated mm -hmm. uh roma winning cinematography right roma winning what was the other thing it won uh, best foreign film. Foreign film, which I haven't seen the other four. What films, about so Regina really King, like E. Rich? I didn't see the movie she was yeah, in. Yeah, neither did I. That was a good uh, pick on you, though. <laughs> I, I picked it because pick. she was the only transgender option. Because she is the king. Oh. E. Rich is a racist who doesn't want black people to succeed. I agree. I stand a king. I don't Regina agree with that king. statement. I agree that E. Rich believes it. It's true. I want black people to succeed. <laughs> wow, thanks for clarifying. <laughs> I, I just have to put that in there, just in case. Uh, well, just just in case the, the principal is yeah. watching this. Yeah. <laughs> the only movie with Mokola. Hobear Harvey, thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard. Uh, I thought they were about to go into, uh, what's that uh, Kanye West song? Kanye West song? Yeah. I don't Pussy know. stays on my mind. Monkey is racist confirmed. Runaway. Oh, no. That's it. What song? I thought it was about to play Runaway. 
Hmm. Run away from me, baby! Patchy, everybody's here because they want to see my reaction if Black Panther wins. It's wait, seven minutes away, folks. T minus seven minutes to Monkey's Reckoning! Yeah, we'll see what happens to him. Here we you go. You should have made some kind of fucking. Some kind of what? For every single movie that you didn't pick, there should be some kind of punishment behind that. No, no, because then I have to do a 24 hour stream no matter what. <laughs> like, I lose I no matter what levels. happens then. There should be levels of it. That's too late. I'm I'm only I only have a bet and folks if you're not aware if Black Panther wins I'm watching it on stream for 24 hours if Green Book wins I'm watching Brad Dassey's I'm coming home on stream for 24 <laughs> hours if anything else wins I'm a free man Mm-hmm. Monkey doesn't count as a free black friend e rich God Almighty free at last all right let's see who's the best actress of the year probably Melissa McCarthy all right God damn it if Melissa wins I think it's fair to say I get an extra three points right e rich no, not if Melissa wins. <laughs> Come on. If Black Panther wins, Come that's on. Picture, you get an extra four points. Bullshit. Wow. Oh, God, this guy's going to be insufferable, isn't he? He's so fucking old. Our final nominee oh, oh, that's the chick from that one movie I saw. <laughs> oh, wait, wait. Is that the woman from The Hate You Give? Yeah, The Hate You Give. I'd recognize those breasts anywhere. Yeah, yeah. I th I think she's 22, right? We we, we clarified yeah, that we before. Yeah, we established this. Good, very good. Because mm -hmm. <laughs> I made her breast the thumbnail for that episode. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> her hair looks like a snake. Who is this dude? Uh, Al Sharpton. Isn't that Barack Obama's dad? <laughs> Thank God people watching the stream can't see what we're talking about, huh? Mm -hmm. Why is there a big titty black woman and a pug on my TV? He doesn't look, he looks like a pug. He doesn't look like a pug. He doesn't look like a pug? That's not racist to say. I mean, he looks like a cute little nah, uh, sc scruffle-faced doggy. Hmm. Hello, kitty. Thank you for subscribing. The characters in Green Book well, let's let's see this little uh, Oscar trailer for Green Book. Maybe it'll entice me to watch the film. Mm. Yeah, Amanda Amandla Stenberg. Um, I I think that's gonna be one of my hall passes that I cheat on sheep over with. Mm. I think uh, I think I'm gonna have to arrange that. I was Steve? gonna say you need her permission to do a hall pass, right? No, no, I can make up my own. No. <laughs> Damn. I'm I'm the man. I can make up my own hall pass. <laughs> <laughs> Hope you suffer, monkey boomer. Oh no! Black Panther donated six dollars and nine cents to tell me he hopes I suffer. Oh no! That's not even a sixty-nine. That's a six with a zero. I would. I, I much prefer the six dollars and nine cents over sixty-nine cents. <laughs> if no, he wants to give sixty-nine dollars, I mean, I know he's a king. He does have. <laughs> he does have the funds. I didn't know that if you put in one of my emojis, it would read it out loud. That's funny. It read the yes. boomer emoji. Drag him, king. <laughs> what? Yas. No. Yas. Why is Sam Rockwell bald? Is he doing this for a movie or is he? I just don't know, bored? man. He's fucking. He's the one who knocks. He's the guy who throws people out of two-story windows. Whoa! That's it's three billboards. They're reunited. Oh shit! You're right. Hell yeah! Was that really last year? Yeah. That was Fuck, last dude. Year. Life was so much better a year ago. So long ago. Oh man, there's a movie at the Oscars that I wanted to win. Mm-hmm. Asperger was out of prison. Everything was was uh, big ups for Liquid Monkey. You you never saw Roma, did you? Even though it's free on fucking it, Netflix. It's boring. <laughs> It just looks boring. Uh, 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 I hate subtitles. I don't even watch anime uh -huh. with subtitles. I watch fucking dubs. Oh my god. Listen, I'm an okay, English great. major. If I want to read, I'll grab one of my mini books. When I watch a TV, I, I want to watch the TV. I didn't know what's his name was in the in the wife. What's Har this guy's name? Uh, Rob Schneider. No. <laughs> He's also in Mr. Robot. Why can't I fucking remember anything around Mr. Robot? I don't know. I guess you don't like Christian, that Christian uh, Slater. Yeah, That's Brendan it. in the chat is, uh, he's shitting on you because you said free on Netflix. Netflix you have to pay for, E-Rich. You can get a free, uh, uh, 
Yeah, you can get my dick Trial for free if you points. fucking open your mouth a little bit more. Find another fucking uh, email address to use for your free yeah. trial. I'm gonna do erichkino at gmail.com. That's right. Oh, that's what I actually use. Is it really? Right. Uh oh. No, no, no. I uh, I'm sorry. Is, uh, it, is it Kino? No, you don't. You don't want to say your email to these people, Erich. Is it Kino? One, two, three. Oof. <laughs> One, two, three. Fake email street. Yeah. Fake at, street. At, at fake gmail.com. Uh huh. Imaginary way. Do you think that Lady Gaga stands a ghost of a chance? Uh, n n no, no, she doesn't. Okay. She's been waiting for some kind of an award. Come for on, Melissa McCarthy, more. baby! Mm. You stand a queen, and her name is Melissa McCarthy. Only because the Happy Time Murders was the film of the year. <laughs> Did you forget that me and Florian just picked meme answers and you took this shit seriously? No, well, occasionally. Yeah. But I mean, like, the meme answers have kind of... I, I won once if with a meme every answer. Category, if we did every category, you then might I, have won. I might have, yeah, because I would have done Black Panther and Bohemian Rhapsody for everything. Yeah, right. Oh, uh, come on, yes, queen. Yeah! Yeah! Wait, did fucking you, clincher Is, is that right who there. you picked? Yeah, Are it is. Are you fucking kidding me? You, you have five guesses correct now? I stand a queen, and her name is Olivia Coleman. This is bullshit. She is she is a great fucking actress, man. She's been hard at work for forever. I'm putting it in the chat as Olivia Coldman. Oh. That's how I feel in my heart. Clever. Yeah, very clever. She is the queen. All right. Let's just get to Black Panther's epic victory. Fucking and Lady Gaga. <laughs> Lady Gaga the... already has an Oscar. She's fine. Yeah. Bradley Cooper fun. was, uh, he got cucked. He didn't. He, it's his song, yeah. and he didn't even get an Oscar for it. He's far from the shallows now. Oof. Actually, he's in the shallows now. Oof. <laughs> he hung himself in his garage, but I'm just... Oof. <laughs> oh, so wait, yeah, so the favorite finally won something. What do you know? Yep, yep. Probably not going to win Best Picture, is it? Mm -mm. I mean, if we base... Best picture off of what has won the most awards, which did not work with Mad Max Fury Fuck Road. You. But if Fuck it, you. but if that's what they're, Don't. it might Don't even Erich, it might end Don't. up because no. the, the Golden Globes chose a certain film Shut as best the musical. Fuck up. Shut the or was fuck it best up. drama? Either way, I think Bohemian Rhapsody might win the Oscar, Erich. No. Would that be more offensive to you than Black Panther? Um, it might, because I actually liked Black Panther. <laughs> yeah, and you hated Bohemian Rhapsody. I eventually liked Black Panther. <laughs> People are telling me to calm down. No, I will not calm down. <laughs> Monkey, here's your chance to back out on your bet. No, I never back <laughs> down, baby. Hell yeah, we're doing it. <laughs> <laughs> Black Panther wins. We're starting the stream right now, buddy boy. <laughs> 24 <laughs> hours, baby. See you oh, wait, tomorrow right at midnight. Now, right, right at midnight. Yeah. I'll, I'll watch it in the background as we record his Aquino. <laughs> Where the fuck is Florian? Is he still asleep? Uh, he be right now. Uh, our voice connection is all shit. I can't even hear you now. You're all robot -y. You're Mr. Yeah, robot. You're, you, you're going to win the Oscar. Black Panther 1, Wakanda Forever. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, E. Rich, our, our voice connection is all fucked up, so... <laughs> I don't know. I guess I'll, I'll talk for you. I'm E. Rich. I love Bohemian Rhapsody. Look at How's me. How's that? Is that any better? Uh, yeah, it's, it's better. Yeah, yeah. I literally just left and came back. Yeah, we have three bars now. I, I Wakanda was... Forever! No! <laughs> I'm gonna have a meltdown if it wins. Shut the fuck up, you queen bitch. I wanna see who wins the best picture. She's gonna be the queen in uh, the queen. Or, I'm sorry, the, the crown. Hey, Rich, nobody cares. Wasn't the show a supposed crown for to. A king. Wasn't this supposed to end at 11? Why is it 11.03? Yeah, good, good point. They tried to get it to three hours, but they couldn't do it. <sighs> And now we have another commercial. Yep. Hey, it's uh, Gambino Del Taco. <laughs> Hell yeah. 
It's uh, Jack Black will play him in a future biopic. <laughs> That is an amazing idea. Holy yeah. Well, can Jack? Bl I mean, I mean, Jack Black was in that one uh, Spanish Nacho Libre movie, right? Maybe he can do yeah. some Spanish. Yeah. Yeah, he's he's well off enough with the community. <laughs> sure. I scare queen. I'm actually feeling nervous about who's gonna win Best Picture because Black Panther I don't think is super likely, but Green Book definitely is. And that's so almost wait, you're worse. You end up watching Brad Dassey for 24 hours, or is it 250 times? Well, it, it's it's the same thing. It's 24 hours. I, uh, oh, oh, yeah. I see, I see. Um, so wait, is it just his content, or is it that one? Oh, just song? the the one five minute song on repeat. Oh my god! Yeah, you will go insane. At least man. Black Panther, I get to watch a movie 12 times. With this, it'll be the same thing every five minutes. Mm hmm. Shit. And Wait, that, we we have to do best director, don't we? Oh, you're right. So there's two more awards. Yeah. Wow. Well, yeah, yeah. I knew we were missing something. I guess we'll see more from uh, what's his name, Quran. Yeah, Quran. Yeah, he'll give another good speech. <laughs> For director, Florian just wrote the Cold War because we don't know the name of the director. <laughs> of it's Powell Powell Kalski or something. Uh, I don't know why I picked the Cold War. What was my meme answer for that one? Probably just I picked uh, the one that was obviously not gonna win. Yeah. If you guys at home want to watch along, if you don't have access to the Oscars, go to breddygood.com. B r e t t y g o o d dot com. That's where I am currently watching it. Uh, during the commercial break, they they keep playing this documentary about women in India getting their period. I think is what it is. Mm -hmm. Um, so don't be confused if that's what you see. Ba 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 ba, pretty good. Ba 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 ba, pretty good. There's no uh, pedophile shit. category, unfortunately. I give it time. Who are who are all these people up at the top of pretty good? Because I don't remember. That's Dougie. That's Saul. Yeah. I don't know what the third guy is. That's Neil Breen. I don't know what the fifth guy is. Then we have Nicholas Cage. Uh, Nicholas Cage from Mandy. Uh, we, we got the pretty good bear himself. We have Nathan. Oh, there is uh, Nathan. I don't know who this old guy is. There's the cop. The guy in the uh, end is uh, is that one Affleck. great actor that we all love. What great actor? The I guy at the, the very the far right isn't that the guy from uh, the Hateful Eight? Oh, is that really Walton Goggins? Isn't that Goggins? It looks like. Him I to don't me. think that's Goggins. Really? I, I can see why you think that with the hairline. Uh, and everything. Well, hope you have caffeine, Mumkey. You know, if it wins, we're not doing the stream tonight because we got to do Kino. Oh. I'm gonna. Don't worry. Don't you worry. If I. If it wins, I'll probably start the 24-hour stream tomorrow at noon. I got to mm -hmm. get a good night's rest in and then Shit, prepare. Dude. Yeah. Yeah, right. Not looking forward I'll to try, it. I'll try to poke in from time to time, but <laughs> good I'll luck. work at 13 hours tomorrow, man. Fuck! How often do you work 13-hour days? Uh, it depends on when I'm scheduled for that much time. <sighs> you live in the American dream, you rich. That's right. I'm a wage slave. <laughs> wage cuck. Mm. Oh yeah, I can't say slave. That's uh. That's the Black Panther's word. That's yeah, you're right. <laughs> he sold many Wakanda slaves. Forever! Yeah. No, he's an African king. He sold many slaves to the uh, the colonists back in the day. What's the uh? God, Del Taco's a big guy. What's his name? Did not do the uh, Wakanda Forever thing. Chadwick. I'm trying to listen to Del Taco, dude. Here I am today uh, because I feel a great kinship with this award and with the people it honors. No matter what name is in this. Oh, because he won director last year for The Shape mm -hmm. of Water. Mm. Yep. Whatever. Shape of Fishman. It was fine. I don't. Well, whatever. Yeah. I don't care. Yeah, I, I agree with that. That was that seemed to be a compromise win almost. Yeah. Paste Bunanon. Thank you for subscribing. Like. Look, I totally am behind giving it to The Shape of Water just because that movie is weird as fuck. Yeah. And so I will. I would rather they give it to something weird like The Shape of Water than like something boring like Green Book or. Well, yeah, I was uh, all in on three billboards last year. Yeah, yeah, I and I get that. Okay, um, I'd be okay with Spike Lee awesome. winning this one, even though he made his few silly choices in the movie. 
Uh, um, um, wait, did I pick Spike Lee? Who did I pick? I think Florian picked Spike Lee. I think uh, you picked really? Quran. Quaron. Oh, goddamn. Yeah. Uh, I hope Adam McKay I wins did. just so that you're pissed. The Cold War. Oh my god, if he does. Ah! Ah! Quran yeah! wins the it! Irit! The Erit streak continues. Great. Oh, yeah. Well, I'm going to get 10 points with Black Panther, so just you wait. <laughs> that hurts. <laughs> that hurts me to do. Yeah, I, I think I think you have Spanish, like six man. points right now, dude. Yeah, man. It's an Erit's kind of year. This is some bullshit. Actually, it's not. I fucking hate this year. Because <laughs> of this all the Bohe Bohemian Rhapsody awesome. wins? Yeah. It's fucking pissing me off. Okay, let's hear the same speech again, buddy. Give him his fucking Oscar. Wait, so if he wins Best Picture, are we going to hear him say the same speech three times? Yep, yep. Cool. I would like to thank uh, Yalitza. Please don't make fun of his accent. He's a he's a very uh, respected he's man in this household. Yeah. Yes, I don't, I don't know why you have to mock his... I mean, he speaks more languages than you. I don't know why you're making fun of the way he talks, E. Rich. It's, it's disgusting. It, it's just a great accent. <laughs> Oh, you're doing it because you want to sound like that, because he's so cool. I, I want to be anything but white, yes. <laughs> <laughs> Turn the volume up. Fuck no. I'm not getting banned from Twitch. You go watch this yourself. <laughs> uh, Pixelated Boat on Twitter says, Bohemian Rhapsody wins best picture made by a pedophile who got fired from the movie, but not for being a pedophile. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, why did he get fired from the movie? He was being For difficult. not showing up to work. <laughs> For non-pedophile reasons? Yes. Oof. All right, he's got the new card. What did Erich bet? We all bet that the person who gets the most correct gets to choose a movie that we kino. Mm -hmm. And Erich is going to be boring and pick a good movie when I was going <laughs> to pick something silly. Hey, a good movie that you guys didn't see. Whatever. So I'm forcing you to do it. Can't wait for that... 500 downloads we'll get on Podbean for that one, E. Rich. Yeah, right, right. Great. <laughs> what, you want to do... <laughs> oh, I don't know if I can say this. If it's the title of the movie, can I say the N-word? No. No. It, does it have to do with gay people who are from outer space, yeah. E. Rich? Yes. We already did that movie. I didn't do that. Well, yeah, but me and I think Manimal did like four years ago. Shit. And uh, I did say the title in full several times during that wow. review. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> what are you going to do? <laughs> it's the title of a movie. Man, in high school, I would talk to my <laughs> teachers about Inglorious Bastards, and I was allowed to say it. Because it's the title. Who won director last year? Del Taco. Del Taco won both director and picture? Yeah, dude. I guess that, that happens a lot. Yeah, that's why we were even talking yeah. about him. Okay. Damn. Damn, the fucking Mexicans are conquering. Yeah, they really are. The back wall back is years. being put up too late. They're already here and making good movies. In, a, in Birdman one not too long ago, I mean, they're killing it. And Inaritu? Yeah. God damn it. I mean, I imagine Inaritu's got to be... He, he's Mexican, right? Inaritu? Uh, I don't know. I assume he is. What did that donation say? Uh, still haven't seen Black Panther. Might join in to watch along for one viewing. You know, Not before that. When I'm watching Black Panther, you guys don't get to see it. <laughs> yeah, I'm not streaming a, a Marvel film on my Twitch. It's You guys will watch me watch it for 24 hours. Yeah, well... I think I'm gonna I'm, I'm gonna put a mirror right here so you can see the reflection of my screens, so you know Wait, I'm actually two, watching it. Two years ago, Mahershala won for best supporting actor, and he won again this year. Really? I didn't realize he already won. Fuck. Maybe he'll win for True Detective next year. In that case, you shouldn't fucking win again. Give it to somebody else. Yeah. That's not that's not fair, e. Rich. If you it give the fair. best performance two years in a row, you should win twice. I have I haven't seen fucking Green Book, so I'm allowed to say fuck that movie. <laughs> I don't think so. My name is Erich, and I'm here to say fuck Bohemian Rhapsody. Um, yeah, the, the mirror can get me banned. Why would I get banned for accidentally having a mirror reflecting my monitor? It seems fair to me. 
Oh, you'll watch the film on Netflix? Oh, it's on Netflix? Good. I was going to torrent it. It is on Netflix, yeah. Oh, thank God. Armin White should have his own awards. Uh, I would watch that way more than I would watch the Oscars. And I'm watching I'm the so Oscars fucking... right now. I'm so split. I'm practically James McAvoy. Like, because I want something that's not Black Panther to win. But you also want Black Panther and, to win. And I want something that's not Green Book to win. Oh my god, it's but the I, time! It's time! It's time! I do want you to- Shut up! Me. Shut up! <laughs> I'm about to shit! No, what were you saying? I'm sorry. I shouldn't be that rude. I want you to suck her. Okay. Is she wearing fish bones? Wait, is this horse face? Is this, is this no. Susan's uh, sister? Who is this? Each is different in its appeal. But they prove once again that regardless of who you are, it sounds like sheep over this. screaming downstairs. I don't know why. These are films that wow. connect us to one another. It's on delay, so maybe again, she knows who won. For best uh I don't think so. Because the chat would have told me. Okay, Kevin Black Feige. Panther. Okay. Black why do they put Kevin Feige? Because he's the producer. I guess. Yeah, okay. I'm not going to look at the chat because we're delayed a little bit, so they right, might see right. it before we do. Oh, God. <sighs> okay. Monkey. Luckily, Fuck. you and me are watching the same stream, so neither one of us I will know. get spoiled before the other I one. Know. I, I, I want I want to look at the chat so bad, but I can't. Man, Vice, Vice winning would be the ultimate fuck. Oh, God, here it comes. No. And the Oscar goes to Green Book. Ah! Brad Dassey. <laughs> Fuck me. Fuck! See if you can interview him while you're watching his stuff. Fuck! That's gonna suck! <laughs> oh, this is so great. It's hard enough just staying awake for 24 hours. I gotta sit here watching that shit. Are you fucking kidding me? Green Book's the best movie of the year, you fucking uh, liars. Uh, uh. <laughs> Bullshit! This is, the boring, this is the boring fucking choice. Of course, the Academy goes first. What a nightmare! I personally want to thank Christina and Mahershala is like on the absolute outside of this, being like, "I don't have to be here. I don't have to be here, like for real." Fuck off! The room is so fucking quiet. Nobody gives a shit about Green Book. Damn it. Thank you very much. You know, this is, he's right, this is, the whole story is about love. It's about loving each other. It's about love. The, the movie's about love. Are they going to let a black person speak for this award? No. No, not for Green Book? Right there. No movie. All these awards are because Vigo and Mahershala and Linda, but it started with Vigo. Oh, Linda Carter leading, isn't it? I like her. She's uh, Daphne and uh, I'm sorry, Velma and uh, Scooby Doo. And Aileen Roberts, Octavia Spencer, Chris Bowers, Donna Langley, Jeff. Please tell me this is another La La Land fiasco. Just give it to Black Klansman. They're going to open up a green book, and inside it'll say Black Klansman. <laughs> <sighs> Where's Florian? Let's just do this fucking yeah. podcast. Let's let's fucking get this shit over with. I don't think he's gonna be here till midnight. We're no. Please yeah, don't say we that. We told him Fuck. don't don't come till midnight because that's like six a.m. for him, dude. He's not even awake yet. Let's let's start recording at eleven thirty. No, wait no, up. we can't and then start without tell him he lost as soon as he pops on and then end the episode. Uh, my condolences, thanks. <clears throat> All right, folks. I'm not That's sure it. when. It'll be very soon. 
within the next couple days, I will be streaming Brad Dassey's I'm Coming Home for 24 hours straight. My question to you, chat, is who will take the pledge to watch it with me? Come on! You know you want to. Somebody. And I won't even have to do a mirror. This isn't copyrighted shit, I don't think. I can just show it on no. the screen along with me. The the biggest meme would have been watching Black Panther, but you didn't even get fucking Yeah, so that. I can't even get, like, face... Or I can't even get Twitter likes for this because nobody gives a shit. Every Black Panther yeah. post w was retweeted to death. Nobody's going to give a uh -huh. fuck about this. <laughs> I'm doing this yeah. to an audience of probably ten people. Uh -huh. I'm fucked. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna put on a uh, I figured out how to oh let us say a Buddhist prayer for Mr. Monkey. <laughs> yeah, everybody do a Buddhist prayer for me. Thank you, Nico. Maybe I'll put in a uh, a stream goal like one thousand dollars <laughs> to pay for my funeral <laughs> right, after right. I fucking kill myself. Wow. You think I can raise a thousand bucks in twenty four hours of streaming, Rich? It'll go to the charity no. of Monkey's Wallet. Everybody's no. favorite charity. All right, the Oscars are over. Everybody, get the fuck out. We'll be we'll be back with the Kino once Florian wakes the fuck up. Mm hmm Fuck. Well. What should we do? Should we just hang out with the chat for a while? Um Yeah, yeah, let's hang out a little bit. Okay. I'm so fucking happy in it. Did anybody take the pledge to watch the stream with me? When I do the twenty four mm. hours. I know E Rich will not. <laughs> I, I can't even have guests come in to talk. Because it, I'm playing a, a loud reason. song. Why can't you have a guest? Oh, yeah. I mean, I mean, like, it's if I mute the song, it defeats the whole purpose. Uh huh. Yeah, literally nobody it, like, wants to. Yeah, that's the point. I know nobody wants to. That's why I'm asking. Yeah, no, let's give them a taste of what they're going to be hearing. Um, no, why would you do this to yourself? Because I'm stupid. <laughs> oh, I guess we didn't do it. Yeah. We didn't do it. Wait, is, I will... is it that song? Which one is it? It's uh, I'm Coming Home. Coming home. Oh, yeah. shit. Now, I, I know for a fact man. that I am the man who has listened to the song more than anybody else on Earth, including Brad Dassey. <laughs> but after this stream, it will be confirmed that I, I don't think anybody will ever beat me in the most plays of this one song. Let's, uh, let's take a listen. I dedicate this video oh, to God. Marlene Glish, my grandmother, okay. who was passed in uh, 2008. <sighs> mm -hmm. She had taught me about music when right. I was younger and... I just dedicate this video to her. I just Man, want to say, Graham and Marlene, I love That's you. That's best picture. And uh, I hope Brad Dassey can't wait to make it to uh, watches the stream. And the song is about coming mm. to heaven, and uh, I'll see you when I come home. Yeah, here's a taste of what I'll be watching for 24 hours, folks. I love you, Jesus. Are we supposed to hear something here? Uh, they can hear it. You can't hear it. Ah, uh, okay, I see. Oh, you have to watch the stream. I, I'm in the stream. I just mute you. All right, there I'm, we go. I'm really not looking forward to this. Actually, this is actually a. I think Man, this was actually a horrible mistake. Your brain. This this image of the Capitol building or whatever. It's gonna be a whole that. day wasted. <laughs> I can't do work. I can't no, communicate with my friends. Work. I'll be and sitting here can. watching this. The best you can do is try to raise some money, yeah. donate part of it to charity. Oh, no, charity! Fuck no! This donate it to autism awareness. That okay? That's actually a really good point. <laughs> I, I might do that. Well, at least the Brad right Dassey emoticon will get used. God damn it! You're gonna go insane. Yeah, <laughs> no shit. There's, oh my god. <laughs> Just this static shot of him standing there, shaking his arms. I've made a horrible mistake. Dude, you're going to be, like, transported to wherever the fuck you live. I'm going to get an ear infection from wearing these earbuds all day. No. It's no. fucked. You have to be able to... Just get several pairs of earbuds or headphones. I, like I might just have it play through my TV. Yeah. Man, why did you do this? Why would you do this? Because I, I genuinely like the song, and I didn't think yeah. Green Book would win. Yeah. No, I'm not starting now, Sheep. I'm just showing everybody what it is. <laughs> He's getting a little taste of his poison. It's a completely illogical bet, because Green Book has nothing to do with this it song. It was the fucking favorite as well. <laughs> 
It was one of the favorites. Like, it was one of the ones... It wasn't the favorite, but it was one of the favorites yeah. that were going to win. So, like, when people ask, why are you doing this for Green Book? I don't know what to uh -huh. tell them, because it was an <laughs> illogical choice. It was just yeah. random. Mm -hmm. I, like, does Green Book have a, a God message in it? It's about, like, a preacher, right? Yeah. Okay, so there you go. And I guess he does music. <laughs> so, you know what? Maybe it does make sense. Uh, I guess. Oh and shit, die, man! It's the circle of life. We are free, free to be. Free as can be, or free to. Be. Yeah. There's one God in this nation. Oh wow, Brad Dassey just tweeted ten hours ago. Oh, I thought you meant right now. No. <laughs> Saying fuck you, monkey. Two hours ago, he tweeted a link to his Facebook, where he literally just took a picture. Wait, no, it's on somebody else's. Never mind. I'm fascinated by Brad Dassey. <laughs> Me too. Nolan says thank you. Who the fuck's Nolan? Uh, must be his kid. Wow, he, he photographed his kid as, uh, thanking everyone for wishing him happy birthday. His, his kid's name is Nolan. Okay. What about this? You can only be online if it's Brad Dassey's Twitter. Oh, I can just refresh his but, Twitter while watching. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but you have to be listening to this song at all times. Well, well, well I mean, that's a given. <laughs> that's, surely, I, that's as long as as long as I'm listening to the song, surely I can use my laptop to look at other things. I have to assume, unless I have to okay. stare at this right. video for 24 hours. I mean, I'll be reading the chat too, of course. Right, right. Hopefully the chat will keep me sane. I just cannot fathom having these one of this. <laughs> this is uh, the life I've chosen. Florian Florian will surely join you for many hours. <laughs> I hope this, right? so. It's not like he has anything else to do. Alrighty, I tweeted the announcement that this is going to happen probably on Tuesday. How, how are you going to piss? I, I think I get bathroom breaks, surely. Nah, man, get a bunch of uh, you, glasses. You, you can't do a poop jug on Twitch. <laughs> poop jug. Like fucking poop jug. Carve a hole into your fucking uh, chair and then shit through the chair. <laughs> like the on The Simpsons when Homer invented the, the lazy boy toilet? Yep. Oh, God. It does kind of piss me off how much uh bohemian rhapsody black panther one and now it's bohemian rhapsody one god damn it all you're, this you're really shit unhappy about bullshit. most of these wins other than roma i'm an unhappy person in general <laughs> true scumpy Wait, what scumpy you fucked up your your donation i can't read it this guy's fucking wrong who this guy on Twitter says, showed Samuel Jackson and says, Sam Jackson's reaction when he sees Green Book laid me out. He didn't present something for, oh wait, he did do original screenplay. Mm. I thought he just did Spike Lee's win. He Did he do Adapted? Because I remember him freaking the fuck out when I, Spike Lee won. I, I don't remember, dude. <laughs> I'm, uh, I'm kind of in a haze right now. Oh, God. I mean, at least Bohemian Rhapsody didn't win Best Picture. At I, least I really, really wish it would have. Why would you wish that on anyone? It'd, it'd be better for me. <laughs> Am I going to cry, piss my pants, maybe, shouldn't come? Probably all of the above. It's going to be a... <laughs> Don't miss that stream, folks. I'm sure, some, I'm sure somebody will record it and make a supercut of all my greatest moments of losing my fucking mind. Where is Florian? Wake up! Wait, so did anybody pick Green Book for best picture? Um, no, we, we didn't. Me no. and Florian both said Black Panther. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And you said Black K. Klansman. Mm -hmm. Mumkey will finally come on stream. Hell yeah. Wow. You haven't done it yet? Not yet. I'm saving it for Brad Dassey. Damn. Saving all your comings for Brad Dassey. <sighs> 
Tuesday at 12 a.m. or noon. I don't know when it's starting. I'm I'm not in the right state of mind to plan that far ahead. <laughs> <sighs> Spike Lee lost Best Picture to both Driving Miss Daisy and Green Book. Ooh. <laughs> nice. <laughs> what a long career he's had. <laughs> <laughs> Man, this picture of Guillermo del Toro. Goddamn. Moody Blues, thank you for subscribing with Twitch Prime Hero. Can I listen to this version of the song, folks? The the Wait, are there remixes? The yeah, listen. What the fuck? Is that something he made? This is Asperger. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> You haven't uh, heard this yet? You're not allowed. I have not heard this. You're not allowed to do that. God damn it. Those I mean, th this allowed. is a much worse version of the song. It, it really is. This is That's fucking awful. <laughs> fucking Cake Jerry Vivo made this. Good lord. <laughs> it's really funny. Wow, Black Panther only won three. It seemed like it won more. It was nominated for like 80 of them. Yeah. Shit. This is called The Only One Coming Home by Cake Jerry Vivo on wow. YouTube. If you wanted to check it out. Cake Jerry. You know what's funny? When I, yeah. the thing I do on my streams most of the time is to end each stream, I will listen to I'm Coming Home. So maybe to end the 24 hour stream, I will celebrate by listening to I'm Coming Home. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Guys, you know what? The stream's over. We did 24 hours. Oh, let's listen to it one more time. <laughs> I should probably start the stream. Well, I don't know, because it's 24 hours. So when yeah. it ends, I want to go to sleep. So I shouldn't have it end at noon, because then my sleep schedule's all fucked up. But if I have it start at, like, midnight, then that means I was already up for a long time waiting for the stream to start. What is the logical time to start this stream? There isn't one. I'm fucked no matter what. Sure are. Yeah, I guess I'll just probably- You made your bed. I'll start it at like noon, I guess, and then, and then sleep at noon the next day. Whenever Butterfly drinks alcohol, the Popeyes theme starts playing. That's like his spinach. I assume he meant Asperger. <laughs> 8 p.m. Yeah, just fuck your, fuck your sleep up. That's right. Started at 8 in the morning. That'll ruin my sleep schedule more than anything else. Or our battle plan. Where am I going to get food from? I guess sheep will have to actually sheep pull her fucking deliver. weight around here for once. <laughs> for once! She'll bring me Bojangles! Okay, here we go. Got to turn up the volume. Mr. Bojangles. It seems pretty perfect that uh, Lord Miller got Oscars and Star Wars ain't got shit. <laughs> yeah, get fucked. Mm -hmm. Ooh, Kathleen Kennedy, you bitch. You know who got fucked the most this night? Me? Uh, Bradlin Koopsie. Yeah, he didn't even get nominated for director. Yeah. What the fuck? Right. <laughs> this life is not our own. <laughs> is that what you have to tell yourself? Yeah. <laughs> I'm just singing along to Brad. Mm. Oh, I see, I see. We must make love last. I'm coming. Oh. Where in the fuck is Florian Himsel? Uh, it's 11:33. I can't wait another 27 minutes. It says that he's online. What? 
Get in here, fool. When is Monkey Box coming back? Well, I'm working on it as uh, as we speak, my friend. But it looks like I'm going to miss out on a whole day of productivity. <laughs> Believe it or not. All right. Don't I worry, it's coming. He better be on here soon. Yeah. Infinity Maybe War got snubbed. Maybe he woke snubbed. up at 11th. Oh, Infinity War didn't get snubbed. How is the court case going? I don't know. I don't. I'm not involved in it. The. I I, I assume uh, he means the Asperger one, but I don't know. Uh, okay. I don't know any other court cases in the Monkey Jones cinematic universe. Is is the uh, Asterios thing not part of your? Uh yeah. Review? That's uh that's still just in limbo as we wait for the yeah. next trial. So. I was gonna say, uh, is it, it sounded from uh, Boomer versus Zoomer that he was kind of like vacillating between giving it up and kind of keeping going. Uh, yeah, but that's been the struggle for a while now. But it sounds like he's gonna keep going. <laughs> okay, all right. All right. Yeah, I don't. It, think it's got to be hard to maintain that, but yeah, especially I, I when think... he's pouring money into it, and even if he yeah, wins, right. the Maddox has no money to give him. <laughs> So it's like, <laughs> what's even the point, monetarily speaking? It's like, yeah, you brought up like the what gambler's fallacy or whatever. Yeah, but where you don't chase good ma money after good, um, bad money after good. Yeah, good money after bad. Well, I, I get what you're saying. <laughs> yeah. What's Florian dreaming about? Uh, probably the Fourth Reich. Mm -hmm. We have to assume. Sounds like him. At least me and him both got one point in the Oscar pool. You, did you both only get one point? Yeah. I got the first <laughs> the first vote of the night, so I was like, oh, yeah, I'm winning. Luck is on my side. And then it all oh, went nice. downhill. Mm-hmm. You're at sweep. Would you and Asterios come to Canada for the Boomer versus Zoomer tour? Yeah. Uh, Asterios has done shows in Canada before, so I imagine we would go. Where in Canada would you go? I don't remember where he went. How far are you willing to go in Canada? Probably like whatever city is closest to New York so we can just drive there or take the train. Mm. Respond to this or I'll sub to Quentin Reviews. I don't give a shit if anybody subs <laughs> to Quentin Reviews. I'm sure his videos are fine. <laughs> Worst Oscars ever? No. I think not having a host actually helped us show out, but I'm going to save most of that for the podcast we're going to record once Florian gets here. Come to Brazil. Why do they always say that? They know not a goddamn person is ever going to come to Brazil. It's never going to happen. <laughs> yeah, here it is. Mexican directors have won five of the last six Oscars. Fuck! The They're so talented! Yeah, man. Thank you, Trump. It's all a reaction. They to don't Trump. bring their best people. They bring Guillermo del Toro. <laughs> yeah. And well, they don't need to bring their Alfonso best people. Cuaron. They're already here. Uh huh. Yeah, I'm glad that Quaron got best director and also screenwriting. Not screenwriting. <sighs> Should I actually watch Roma? Do yeah, man. Boomer versus Zoomer in Raleigh, Durham. Yeah, yeah. If we uh, if we would sell enough tickets, we would do it. That'd be easy because we could stay at my house for free. <laughs> we would just have to uh, sell like thirty tickets, and it would be probably <laughs> worth it. You started already. There's yes! Florian. Jesus Finally! Christ! You son of a bitch! Fuck? Why are you starting early? No, we have to. We're not starting. Why? We're just we're, we know we haven't started the show. We're just waiting for you to be ready. Hanging out oh, on okay. stream waiting for you. You have 237 people waiting for you, Florian. Please be ready so I can go to fucking bed. No, he just I'm woke so up. Tired. Yeah, he just he woke just up. Me. Give him oh a second to God. he's got to make his tea. He's got to order his pizza. <laughs> Give him a minute. Let him take a piss Get at least. Get yeah. woken up by the, the news of who won. Oh my god! Oh, well, it's me, isn't it? Uh, you'll be surprised. It's not me, damn it. Alright, hey, Florian, t go go get ready for the day. <laughs> Come back when you're ready and we will start the podcast. Hurry the fuck up. I'm, I'm basically ready. I'm just gonna get water. Okay. Alexa, 
Set alarm for 5 a.m. Oh my god! This is my life. T tell her to play Despacito. Alexa, play Despacito. Is she gonna do it now? Hey, she's doing it. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> this is so sad. Copyright <laughs> I'll turn that shit off. <laughs> Alexa, stop. Okay, I'm changing the name of the stream. I'm going to go get some water myself, and then we will get started on Kino, boys. All right, be right back. <laughs> All right, chat. I'm the only person here now. It's an Eerit stream now. <laughs> Uh, so what do you guys want me to talk about? Fuck you, Erich. Wow. Daring. Never seen that before. Florian is a person. Highly doubtful. Um, no. Shut up, fatty. All right. Um, Erich, sing Despacito. I don't know the words to the Despacito, so I kind of can't. Um, quick, everyone say the N-word. I don't know if Alexa could play. I'm coming home. Lots of fuck Eriches. Hey. Hey, Carson Geek says, sup, Erich. Hey, sup. Um, tell Alexa to shut up. She will turn off. I Wait, can you really tell her to shut up and she will shut up? Erich Asterios is the better liberal. All right. You guys talking uh, shit? Sup, nigga. Want to talk some shit? Wait, what'd you say? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> Do you... What did you say? Excuse me? <laughs> did you say that with a B by any chance? <laughs> what the fuck did you say? What the fuck? What is that called? I don't know. What are you talking about? Gangster hotline? Okay. Oh, yeah, that's it. Gangster hotline. Oh, party line. <laughs> Erich, we're still streaming. <laughs> I told you guys he's a racist off the air. <laughs> you would say dab. Eerich is cool. Is is Florian back yet? Um, no. <laughs> <laughs> wow, people love me now. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder why. I just want to be honest. You make my heart just like Forrest. <laughs> All right, shut up, phone, shut up. Oh, Wings of Redemption is streaming and I missed it. Fucking bullshit. Oh, yeah, I, while we're here, I got to turn off all the Streamlabs shit so it doesn't interrupt the podcast. That's always annoying. Want to talk some shit? <laughs> Erich, I think we can move past this moment and never mention it again. We're good. You'll hear that song 240 times. In those 240 repeats, you'll hear the phrase, I'm coming home. 2,880 times. MK Ultra oh wasn't God. even this cruel with their test subjects. Jesus. Damn. I'm glad you did the math on that. R slash, they did the math. You Do you want to, like, dose yourself on a uh, very potent LSD and then watch it and see what happens? Uh, if anybody wants to uh, Amazon Prime me some LSD, uh, my address is 123 Fake Street. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nowhere, USA. <laughs> every, every town, USA. Make mm -hmm. Florian say all races are created equal. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> well, why is that an oh, no moment, Florian? <laughs> what a weird thing to say. <laughs> Just say it. Say it, no, say it in German. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> he really is refusing to do it. That's so weird to refuse. Oh, yeah? You want to say it? All races are created <laughs> equal? Damn. What are you talking about? <laughs> What's so bad? I guess all you know races are created equal. Hmm. Wow. <laughs> why, why are you being sarcastic about it? Yeah, yeah. Why, why are you saying that ironically? <laughs> you guys There's are weird ironic tonight. Attachment behind that. Did, did you guys like? Know, wow. Did you guys get? Uh, they they spike we your drinks tonight. What's going on? We freakied Friday. <laughs> With I'm who? With wake. each other? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, I'm gonna have to, to work three jobs. No. <laughs> oh no, just quit all of them. 
Yeah, I think I'm just gonna have to run amok. It's the only way. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Fuck you um, and your bone spurs. <laughs> I'm gonna do a test donation to make sure that the sound effect is not still playing. Uh, test donation. Floor. Okay, no sound effect. Let's do a test subscription. Nothing. Test bits. This is a test. Bit you didn't watch it. No, why won't the bits you? ever fucking turn off? Damn it! Turn uh -huh. off. Off, off, off. Out, out, damn spot. <laughs> I hate this shit. <laughs> okay, now it's off, thank god. So do you hear it as well? I guess you do. Yeah, I hear it. Keep the bits on. No! No sound effects during our podcast. Folks, <laughs> welcome to uh, Is It Kino Live. This I think this might be the first day. In history, that we're recording two Kinos in the same day, boys. Wow, wow. Well, at least the, the first time on Twitch that we were doing it. Does this still say Elite Battle Angel for everyone else? Uh, mine says reacting to the Oscars, but yeah. if I refresh the page, it should say uh, the Oscars 2019. Yeah, he's got to refresh Okay, it. there we go. It changed. Okay. Uh, we're going to be recording our Kino episode reacting to the Oscar winners and the show. So for the most part, we will try to ignore the chat because this is a podcast going up on iTunes. And um, once we finish the show, we'll come back and catch up with the chat. How's that sound? Start recording. Okay. Uh, I'm going to get my... Florian, did you literally wake up like one minute ago? Yes. <laughs> oh, God. So, uh, <laughs> wow, we're asking a lot of you to podcast as soon as you wake up. Yeah, you maniacs. Oh, <laughs> is, is it because of what I said? Where I said I wouldn't want to podcast when I wake up right away, and then you, you ambush me. <laughs> hey, you're the one who jumped into the voice chat. Yeah, I, I don't know. I thought you were already live. Yeah, we are yeah, live. You were, actually. Yeah. Mm. <laughs> Evidently, E. Rich forgot. <laughs> <laughs> <Race. laughs> Oof. All right, you oh, boys no. ready? You boys ready? <laughs> Sure. <laughs> niggas reveal. Hey, that's enough. That's Holy enough. Shit, you're rich. We're on Twitch, buddy. <laughs> Watch it. You guys ready or not? Yeah. Okay. Me. Okay. Here we go. Hello, everybody, and welcome back to your favorite movie review podcast. But we're not reviewing any movies today. We are reviewing a television broadcast of the Oscars 2019 a few days ago, or maybe even a few weeks ago. We made our predictions. Who will win which awards? Which films will go down in history as the most glorious statue-winning films of all time? And the person who gets the most predictions right of us three will, of course, be the Kino... Uh, what's, the, what's the phrase we're using for this, E. Rich? The, what's that? The, the Kino Master? I don't, I don't Kino know Master, a Kinographer, who knows? Yeah, the most yeah. Kinoist man of the year who will get to decide... A movie for all of us to Kino in the future. I am, of course, your host, Monkey Jones, joined as always by E Bitch Mick Soy. That's right. I've seen the Oscars, and uh, much like every year, I'm very, very mad. Oh, and somebody, here's the thing all three of us, uh, E Bitch, me, and the third guest who I've not introduced yet, we all just got back from an Oscars party. We were all there together as friends. We all three of us watched the Oscars in full. So to tell us how much fun he had watching the Oscars live is Florian Himsel. Oh my god, what a surprise guest. It's me. The Yeah, I'd never been here before. Well, what, the what Oscars, did you I've definitely seen them. Yeah, yeah. what did you think of the Oscars telecast that we all just watched together? It's pretty lame. Wow. I don't know. Why, what, why do you make me lame. watch this in the middle of the night when I was basically <laughs> sleeping? What did you think of when Bradley Cooper got drunk, pulled out his dick, and peed on stage? Okay, I guess that was kind of cool, but it oh, yeah. doesn't seem like something I would have expected. No, hmm. those, those ants that he peed on are far from the shallow now, you could say. <laughs> <laughs> They're drowning in piss. <laughs> Yeah, that seems like a real thing he did. <laughs> yep. Uh, in case you can't tell, Florian literally woke up five minutes ago. <laughs> this is not a joke or a meme. <laughs> it's the reality of the situation. But we're not here today to talk about Florian's sleeping habits. We're here to talk about who won in our Oscar pool. 
Uh, Everidge, what's the best way to do this? Should we just go through the order of the important categories as they were presented at the Oscars and, and say how we feel about them? Yeah, go ahead. Let's do that. All right. The first one that the Oscars started off with was the best supporting actress. And I can't scroll up because I'm recording the screen. So what were our guesses for best supporting <laughs> actress, Everidge? Let's take a look here. I am not delaying, so I can't find. <laughs> All right. So Florian Hemsel said Glenn Close is going to win for The Wife. Mm, bad pick. I Stupid. said, yeah, Didn't even very, see very shitty it. pick. Oh, I said, wait, the that one? shut the fuck up, Florian. <laughs> I, I said that Olivia Coleman would win for The uh, Favorite. Bad pick. And Monkey oh, said that worst. Melissa McCarthy, no, uh, which what, what? he spelled... No, 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 we're looking at supporting actress, dude. Fuck! Oh, you fool. Right, you fuck. fucked it up. God right, damn so it. Choices. Marina de Tavira would win for Roma. Uh, I said that Rachel Wise would win for The Favorite. Stupid. And Monkey said Regina King would win for If Beale Street Could Talk. Now, Florian, who do you think won? Oh, yeah, yeah. No, Florian, you watched the telecast. Who won? Yeah, right. I, I don't even remember any of these, <laughs> these actresses. Jesus. Well, I think... <laughs> I think I won, of course. No! Okay. Very first award of the night goes to Monkey Jones, baby. Monkey Jones. I'm feeling good at this point. I won the first mm -hmm. point. I'm thinking, wow, this is an un unattainable lead. These guys cannot overcome me. I have one point to their zero. It's going to be a good night for Monkey. I'm probably going to win many more points as the night goes on. Uh, I, I, I felt invincible in that moment. I really did. And then... Turns out... Beale Street can talk. <laughs> yes, King. <laughs> where, where, Florian, are you muting yourself to, to eat breakfast over there? I'm trying to, to see a replay. I can't find one. Now, you, the, mm -hmm. now is not the time to watch the Oscars, you fuck. We're talking on a podcast. We are your replay, you fuck. Well, yeah, I can we're... watch it without sound. It'll be fun. What, oh, great. what are you talking about? <laughs> um, We did not do bets on who would win best documentary, but I'm happy to announce that a movie I put in my top 10 films of the year, Free Solo, won for best documentary. Fuck yeah. Monkey yeah. Kino taste. I think that should count as my second point. Honestly, Everidge, I think it should because I said it was good and it won. So that's, I think, what, three points for Monkey so far? I'm, I'm off to a really strong lead. Um, I'm not hearing wow, any. Yeah. I'm not hearing the peanut gallery try to protest this, so I guess it's official. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, that's how it works. Monkey's well, the official leader. That's I how it works. Else right too, by the way. That's how I'm it just works. letting you know. Wait, wait, I, I know I put, didn't put it on the list, but I, I got all the other things right. Oh shit! Wait, so <laughs> oh, okay, no, no. I think Florian, since he he might be the only man on earth who does not know who won these awards, since you guessed all the other categories correct, would you like to tell us which film won best <laughs> costume design, Florian? Well, definitely Black Panda. It fucking was. <laughs> See, I I know I am the god of the the key. All right, all right, you, uh, you're so fucking smart, Florian. Who? Which movie won best production design? <sighs> Black Panda? God Could it damn be? it! How is he doing this? Yeah. Yeah. Is it Black Pandas all the way down? <laughs> no, no, you think we're joking, but those last two, you were correct. Yeah. I, well, I knew that, but damn. I yeah. don't know how many more pandas there will be. <laughs> so many pandas. <laughs> Black Panda for so, the win. If Florian said Black Panda for any of these, he's wrong, right? <laughs> yeah, that's not a movie. <laughs> Yeah, we don't have any sure. He's disqualified for his accent. Sorry. <laughs> you bastards. I was obviously talking about Uganda Knuckles. What are you doing? <laughs> All right, let's, let's move on to the next one that we actually bet on. It was cinematography. What were our guesses, E. Rich? Cinematography, our guesses were... Wait. Yeah. Uh, Florian said the favorite was going to win. Stupid. Uh, I said Roma was going to win. Stupid. And Monkey said A Star is Born was going to win. That, that's a pretty good guess. And So, Flo Florian, Florian, which one of won? One. Yeah, I wonder. Well, of course, I won. Was it Black Panda? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it was the favorite. Unfortunately, it was not the favorite. Oh, uh, well, it, it's a bad movie, so I'm surprised it didn't win. Ooh. It was 
Roma, which was my pick. So damn it. Yeah. Okay, so now the score go. is Monkey three, Eerich zero, Florian what? negative one. Is that the score right now? I think I'm <laughs> one at this point. Oh wait, oh yeah, that's right. You just got that one point. That makes some more sense. Okay, mm-hmm. uh, Florian, <laughs> you'll be happy to hear this next one. Supporting actor, the nominees oh, between wow. us three were. Are you rich? Supporting actor, we've got Mahershal Ali for Green Book. That Stupid. was your choice for him. Uh, Richard E. Grant <laughs> for Can You Ever Forgive Me? That Dumb, was my choice. Retarded. And Adam Driver for Black Kate Klansman. Now, now Monkey. I want to clarify, I nominated him for The Last Jedi, but it just so <laughs> happened that the movie he per- was nominated for was a different movie. Right. Uh, right, right. So I think that's why he didn't actually win, because they forgot that it was for The Last Jedi when they were voting. Because uh-huh. he was <laughs> he so good in that a... movie. <laughs> Pivotal, Definitely. amazing character in uh, yeah. Jedi. Florian, you'll be happy to know you actually scored a point with Mahershal Shisha Ali. Hey, Hooray. you did it. A movie that I, not only have so. you not seen, but None of us at the seen. point that we voted, you had never even heard of this film. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I heard of it. My mom told me all about it. Uh, I thought that was a, I thought that was a recent discovery. I no, thought she this did was that way before it even came to the cinema where I was going to watch it. Wow. Pretty impressive, really. Wow. Lauren said, Green Book, I thought this was supposed to be a movie competition. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what, now books can win the Oscar for best movie? What the hell? That's my Florian well, impression. I was going to make you watch the movie and then I would have just joined in only no, no, only knowing what my mom told me. Wait, so it's way too much. If you won this competition, you would use your power over us to force us to watch Green Book? No, yeah, not, that's the best I, I would have assumed you would have watched that one anyways. Um, no. Seeing I'm... how important it is. Well, Everidge told culturally. me before the uh, Oscars started, he said he's only going to watch Green Book if it wins the Oscar for Best Picture, so I'm not going to yep. spoil anything, but... Uh... Right. <laughs> Good luck, buddy. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> All right. What's up next? Uh, next, we have Best Animated Feature. Whoa. This was a highly Ooh. anticipated oh, award. Oh, man. So, Monkey, you said Mirai, which was a movie that I had not. <laughs> it's, a, it's a movie I've never even heard of. I, I think I picked it because <laughs> the name reminded me of. Uh, <laughs> Hero uh, Mirai? No, the, the name of the director reminded me of uh, Mia, Miyazaki. <laughs> Uh, I, I figured right. the Jap yeah. shit would have to win, so of course. Speaking of Jap that. shit, we've got Isle of Dogs, the uh, Wes Anderson mm. stop motion animated movie. Florian, that's what you posited was going to win. Oh, good pick, yep. Florian. <laughs> and Thanks. I went with Spider Man into the Spider Verse. And too diverse, Florian? too diverse to win. What do you think, Florian? Bad frame rate. Never gonna win. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what do you think? <laughs> Who do you think's gonna win that one? <laughs> I, I don't know what was Mumkey's guess. Oh, <laughs> some some Jap shit. Oh no. Well, I don't know. I, I I think it might be the Spider Wars. I don't know what I was thinking. Wow. Okay. I should have guessed with the, the black vote as usual. Uh, well, not soon enough. You guessed right, but I already guessed right before you. So <sighs> fuck you, for him. I exactly. now have a not quite lead, but I'm almost tied with Mumkey in our standings. Well, it looks like you have three points. Wait, really? Oh, fuck. Yeah, you've got <laughs> cinematography, you've got animated yeah. feature, and... Uh, what else? I know, you're right. Yeah, you've only got two, and yeah. I've, I've got three because I picked Free Solo, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> hey, that We're awesome. being very, very <laughs> Florian, uh, you're, not, you're not getting any more points tonight. Don't you worry about who's winning. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. Damn. <laughs> it's none of your concern, my friend. All right, let's move on to. We gotta just plow through this shit. Uh, Visual effects. Who cares? E Rich won with fucking First Man. Great. Yeah. Original song. It it wasn't even a contest. The only good song on the rotation was Shallow, so E Rich won Mm -hmm. again. Uh, I think he's now winning four to three. Yeah. Uh, lead actor. Who did we all pick for lead actor, E. Rich? For lead actor, Florian said Vigo Mortensen, Aragorn himself, would win for Green Book. Racist. I said Bradley Coopsy was going to win for A Star is Born. Racist. And Monkey said Willem Dafoe would Thank win you. for At Eternity's Gate. The, uh... the movie that I also have not seen. <laughs> of course. Now, Florian, who do you think won? Uh, ask me again. Jesus. Well, it's probably you, Monkey. Hmm. 
Good guess, but no, none of us won. It was Rami yeah. Malek for the Bohemian Rhapsody movie. He's saying you didn't win Best Actor, damn it. Nobody I did. Know. All three but of us were are, wrong. You should have been nominated and you should have won. Oh, for, well. for my performance in which film? Monkey Jones Stops the School Shooting? <laughs> sure. Now, that was a dual role. Which role would I be nominated for? As Monkey <laughs> Jones or as Vincent the Atheist? Uh, no. Well, damn. I, I guess role. Monkey. I just can't stand that. <laughs> that Winston's face. You don't like Vincent? What the fuck? He's the worst. Oh, bullshit. <laughs> wow, shit. <laughs> Shots fired. Okay, so nobody got a point for that one. Let's move on to lead actress, one that everybody cared about so much. Yep. Lead actress. Absolutely. So for lead actress, we've got Florian said Glenn Close for The Wife. I said Olivia Coleman for The Favorite. And Monkey said Melissa McCarthy. Smart for, choice. Uh, for uh, the Puppet Time murders. Yeah, I said Melissa McCarthy. She might be nominated for Will You Ever Forgive Me, but I thought she deserved the win for the Happy Time mm -hmm. murders. So I, I went with her for that one. I assume I won. <laughs> Was so, that the one where, where she had the crazy sex orgy? Uh, it's the puppet movie, so yes. <laughs> You're right. So she was the main character woman, I guess. Yeah, she played the puppet. <laughs> Great. Everyone's <laughs> <laughs> puppet. All right, well, that's cool. Like, you you can really tell Florian woke up ten minutes ago. Yeah. High energy. <laughs> Poor high man. Energy. Yeah, you just like fucking uh, Jeb Bush over here. High energy, nonstop. <laughs> Uh, unfortunately, yeah. the winner in this category was Olivia Coldman. So E. Rich wins mm -hmm. another point. Damn straight, the queen. I think. Yes, queen. I think E. Rich is on a four four win streak right now. He's won the last four uh -huh. in a row. But as we were watching the Oscars, all three of us together at that Oscar party, we made mm -hmm. an agreement that uh, best picture deserves ten points and best director <laughs> only deserves one. <laughs> So, oh, wow. E. Rich, uh, you're ahead by a few points, whatever. Who won mm. director? So, director, uh, you said Spike Lee, Florian. Um, Spike Lee did win for Best Adapted Screenplay. Um, Monkey said The Cold War, uh, and I said Alfonso Cuaron for uh, Roma, and I was right. It was Alfonso Yeah, who cares? Whatever. doesn't matter. What matters yeah, that's is just one point. the best picture, because best picture, as we just stated, is worth... 10 points. It's anybody's oh, game, man. folks. Could win. It's anybody's game. It's like we're playing Quidditch. And you got that stupid fucking flying golden thing. What's the point the of the hoops golden. and all the other players? Golden. I don't know. Because once you catch the snitch, you win. I don't know no, what the point is. No, 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 I don't no, understand no. what the rest you, of the no, game was about. No, no, no. Once you catch the snitch, the game is over. You get 150 points if you catch the snitch. AKA you win. You, can, you win. It's possible you can score enough points by throwing the quaffle through the hoops. Uh, oh my God. Can the, can the game end without the snitch being caught? Of course. I don't think so. There's I, not a I timer. They can call it. I'm they pretty call sure. It. I, I'm pretty sure that happens a lot because the snitch is really hard to find. Yeah, it's got to be like a timed game, right? Surely they there's no snitch endings sometimes. Well, maybe they just score enough points. Who knows? I think there's well, a lot I'm of long saying. Quidditch games. Well, Quidditch <laughs> fucking sucks. No, no, what okay. E, e Rich, what oh, were our picks game. for best picture? For best picture, I've got Florian said Black Panther. <laughs> That's what's written, Black Panther. <laughs> Do you not know how the word is spelled, Florian? You pronounce I it wrong. You spell it wrong. That. I'm pretty sure I spelled it right. I don't think for so. For monkey, it also says Black Panther. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> However, for me, it just says KKK. So I guess I nominated the KKK for best. Picture. <laughs> and I'm guessing uh, Black Panther wins, which means I win because I have more points than Florian. I would take umbrage at suggesting that I would nominate the KKK for the best picture. <laughs> However, I mean, kind of. Uh, that doesn't have to matter because <laughs> none of us were right. Oh. And uh, yeah, none of these things won. Neither Black Panther nor. Uh, Wait, was Black it the other Panther. Black movie that won? Wait, it was no. the other Black movie. Uh, of course. Green Oscar's book is so black. I mean, why people don't even stand a chance anymore? <laughs> there's there's only one black guy in the movie for it, and the rest of oh. them are white. I mean, but it's, the movie's about <laughs> racism, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, my question is, why is it called Green Book? Shouldn't it be called Black Book? Am I right, Ooh. folks? Mm. Isn't that an anime? Yeah, I don't know. That's I guess Bible you Black, you fucking that. pleb. Yeah, you're right. 
So, are we, uh, are we talking about the Green Mile? <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're talking about the Green Mile. So, uh, some people might not know this, but I made a bet that if Black Panther won Best Picture, I'd watch it on stream for 24 hours. Thank God yeah. it did not happen. Unfortunately, uh, curse God, badly. curse God to hell, because <laughs> I also said that if Green Book wins, I will watch Brad Dassey's I'm Coming Home on stream for 24 hours. And mm -hmm. that is the result we have been presented with. So, unfortunately, oh I think maybe uh, this Tuesday, the 26th, is that? That's tomorrow? Uh, to yes, my... that would be the 26th. Tuesday yes. the 26th, uh, at some point in the day, I don't know what time, maybe noon, <laughs> I will uh, at twitch.tv slash monkeyjones <laughs> do that stream. Damn. Damn. Yeah. So You get yourself into these awful situations, Monkey. I, 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 hope I you don't know. know. It's entirely on your own head. I don't know how you can think that this is gonna be less annoying than watching Black Panther. Oh, it's gonna be much. Times. It's gonna be much worse because I have to watch it two hundred and forty times. Yeah. yeah, I know. Sounds pretty bad. Well, I guess you're definitely gonna hate it after this. <laughs> I don't know if I could possibly hate it. <laughs> no, tomorrow's not Monday, guy in the chat. It's twelve oh four here. But boys, uh, E. Rich, <laughs> e you and I watched the Oscars, and Florian didn't. Were there any moments mm -hmm. worth uh, speaking about, making fun of on this show? Um, not really. I mean, I think it was a faster thing overall, which I think yeah. is much appreciated. But by Golem, a... Golem by showed a... up. What? Golem? What are you talking about? Golem. Well, he's at the Oscar party, isn't he? What? Uh, I... Andy Serkis. What? Andy Serkis, yeah. I didn't see him. It doesn't what, matter. What, what am I watching here? Why is it saying... Why are oh, you watching it, shit? <laughs> right, I guess... Florian, I guess what are you is... doing? I'll say are this. Are you watching... The Oscars was supposed to be a huge, horrible shit show this year. Everything leading uh -huh. up to it made it seem like they don't know what they're doing, which they don't. They couldn't find a host after Kevin Hart was revealed to be a comedian. So, <laughs> um, we all thought it was going to be bad, but I actually liked not having a host. The show went at a faster, brisk pace. They just went award, 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 award didn't waste our time with bullshit Trump shit. Um, I'd say it was a, the ceremony was fine. Uh, yeah. the awards, I <laughs> was not a big fan of who won. <laughs> e Rich, you wanted to talk about Bohemian Rhapsody winning for best editing. So. <laughs> yeah. So guys, I saw Black, no, not Black Panther. Uh -oh. I saw Bohemian Rhapsody uh, a couple days ago, uh, last week, in fact, and it was awful. I think Black Bohemian Rhapsody is one of the worst <laughs> movies nominated for best picture that I've seen in um, years. And it was... Not a good movie. I don't think any of the performances were any good. Rami Malek was all right for a lot of it. Like he was especially good when he was performing a lot of shit. But it, it's just not, not a well-made movie, and a lot of that goes in editing. Uh, there is a scene that is now famously dragged online for essentially just cutting to every single person in the scene whenever they have to react to something, which you don't do. <laughs> you oh no! Frame the shot wide. So you can see multiple people reacting at different times and then occasionally cut to someone when they give a big reaction, not constantly cut every 0.5 seconds in order to show everyone reacting to even a single person taking a chair out of a table. <laughs> it is sounds horrible. the most insane thing. And the fact that that movie won for best editing is, is mind blowing. <laughs> <laughs> I know that um, Adam Johnson of uh, YMS also was very against this movie being nominated for editing. So I'm going to have to mm -hmm. go find his stream highlight of his reaction when it won. I, I imagine it was uh, – he was Damn. Uh, Yeah, appalled. I have to find his, his take on it because it was bad. He Usually on his YouTube channel, he'll post like a compilation of all the best moments of their stream. So I'm looking forward to seeing that. Mm -hmm. Wow. Florian, what did you think of the beautiful ceremony? <laughs> I don't know. I think it's pretty hard to find online. That that surprises me. I I would have assumed it would be somewhere to be seen. Well, no. I guess now I've forgotten all about it because I went to sleep and woke up again. <laughs> uh, why did Brian Singer not show up to accept any of the awards that his movie won? That's a really good question. I w oh, I'm no. wondering why. Yeah. What's going on? Huh. I don't know. Do we have anything else for this recap of the Oscars, this epic Kino showdown? I guess, uh, E. Rich, you are the official winner. Well, we forgot to congratulate you. So 
What film are you going to force us to Kino together oh, no. in the near future? Um, it is a hollow victory, I will say. Um, I liked very few of the movies that were like the big contenders this year, so it, it doesn't feel good. Um, however, my favorite movie of the last year was uh, First Reformed. And so in order to spread the Kino joy um, and not make this a terrible, terrible cost for both of you, I'm going to <laughs> ask the both of you to watch First Reformed. Uh, in the next oh, two months, let's um, say. E. Rich, let me ask you a question. Have you ever had friends yeah. before? Mm-hmm. Do you know how friends interact? They don't do... So you mean, like, <laughs> you, you make their life a living hell? Yeah, you, do, you don't do them, it. like, nice favors and shit. If you win a bet, uh -huh. you're supposed to torture your friends. Why would you choose a good movie? Well, yeah, and, I mean, and when are you finally going to betray Mumki like everyone else? Yeah, <laughs> it's so easy to betray me. I make it so easy. I trust everybody. I'm so kind. <laughs> the longer it takes, the less he'll suspect it. So. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, God. It's, it's I've already days. known you for, like, what, five years? It's a long yeah, time coming. Yeah. So first I'd reform. be looking behind your back around the 15-year uh, marker. We're, we're going <laughs> to celebrate the Oscar victory. We're going to watch a movie that got snubbed out of every Oscar. Except for best uh, screenplay. Oh, original screenplay. but it didn't win that, did it? It did not win. Well, yeah. well what are you going to do? <laughs> Damn. God damn it. Well, it's funny because... Something it's called the Spirit Awards. One of those other awards shows, they got like everything right. Uh, yeah. eight, eighth grade, Bo, uh, Bo Burnham won for best original screenplay or best first time screenplay or something like that. He wasn't even mm -hmm. nominated for the Oscars. Ethan Hawke won best actor for First Reformed, yeah. wasn't even nominated at the Oscars. How do the Oscars make these glaring mistakes? <laughs> um, because it's a bunch of old people. That's that's ageist, E. Rich. How dare you? Yeah, it kind of respect is. Respect but... your elders, man. <laughs> you know, old people know the most about movies. They right. they've been there. They've seen them. Yeah, old people have probably seen way mo more movies than you, E. Rich. What do you know? You, you've seen like the same Star Wars movie ten times this year. <laughs> Every movie is not, not the Last year. Jedi. I have not seen a single Star Wars movie this year. What the fuck? Shut your shut your whore mouth. There's no way you've gone two months without rewatching The Last Jedi, Erich. Yes, e yes, yes. You're full of yes, shit. It can, it can be. He's too busy. Now, he can't e even e see man. his favorite Jedi. Your pick for our yeah. movie is not yet locked in. You can force us to watch The Last Jedi. <laughs> the Last Jedi. It's again. not too late. <laughs> oh, man. We don't have to watch this genuinely good film. Yeah, but you know, watch the first maybe. episode of Star Wars. Come on. Maybe I should change it to that Neil Breen movie where he plays his own twin. <laughs> <laughs> Which one is that? Twin Dragon or Twisted something? Pear. Is Twisted, Twisted Pear. Twisted Pear. That sounds oh, awesome. Oh no, what a stupid name. <laughs> <laughs> nah, nah. We, yeah. We, we can stick with First Reform, D. Rich, if you really, <laughs> truly insist. Oh, man. Shying away from the Breen. <laughs> hey, I like Neil Breen as much as the next guy, okay? Hey, what do you know? How about uh, somebody in the chat recommended um, you make us watch... No, you, there's this little music video called uh, I'm Coming Home by Brad Dassey. Maybe, you should, <laughs> maybe we should watch that. Yeah, uh, there's a, a lot of meat on that bone. There's so much to analyze about that. Yeah. Mm. All right. I really like it, Monkey. I think we're going to wrap up Kino for now. Expect First Reformed perhaps as the next episode uh, because there's really uh, nothing, as far as I know, coming out in theaters until Captain Marvel! You! Oh, oh! Movie of the year 2019. Are you boys ready to get empowered? Oh man, yeah, it's, that, that's gonna be great. Yeah. I don't know what you guys. Superhero don't need no man. Well, she needs Samuel L. Jackson, about. evidently, from the trailer. All so. right. <laughs> yeah, she's cute. I say you, you people are wrong about telling her to smile and everything. You're the one who said that. <laughs> I never. How dare you? <laughs> Hey, if you haven't, if, that's the monkey recommendation of the day. If you haven't seen the movie Room yet, starring Brie Larson, go watch Room. One of the best films of the decade, folks. You're missing out. That's why I was excited when she got cast in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. And then she started talking about her role, and I became a whole lot less excited. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. She straight up said she does not want white men to review the movie. Mm -hmm. Seems oh, a little no. bit, uh, I don't know, biased against a group of people. Would that be? So you're gonna listen to her 
you know, listen to this bimbo. Yeah, I, I th- wow. Well, first of all, I don't know if she's a bimbo. Second of all, are are we legally allowed to kino that movie if the actress starring in the film told us specifically not to review it? Oh yeah, you'd have to to have the the producer say it if it means anything. I, I think what Brie Larson <laughs> she said white men should not review the film. Maybe she wants us to do it in blackface. Does that make sense? <laughs> Florian, will you do the podcast in blackface? Well, that won't be necessary. I'm already not white. Oh, shut up, you Iranian oh, man. devil. <laughs> you, you guys can, need go to go see it. the movie. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, congrats. You're going to see Captain Marvel. Florian, I'm going to be the one. Do, I'm going to be reviewing it and you just listen to me. That's <laughs> yeah, <right. laughs> yes. yes, the minorities will tell us white men what to think of the film. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Thank God oh, for you. Wait. Beautiful. <laughs> Erich, will you be wearing blackface for the review? Uh, no, I will not. I'm the only one who's on camera. Who cares what you guys are doing? You have no idea. I could be in blackface right now. <laughs> I yeah, wouldn't you, be surprised. Well, you just claim to be in blackface. Yeah, that would be great. <laughs> I'm always in blackface. <laughs> All right. All right, Erich, I bestow upon you the title of uh, Kino Patrician of the Year. Finally. Congratulations. <laughs> from For the rest of the year... Whatever Erich's opinion on a movie is will be the Kino opinion. I guess I don't. Wow. Even, I don't know why uh, Florian and I are even on this show anymore. But final say. What are you Hell gonna yeah. do? Yeah, it's gonna be the Erich solo show from now on. Hmm. Erich solo with Star Wars story. The show. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> and That's with that, depressing. with that joke, I will say for is a Kino. I've been <laughs> Monkey Jones, joined as always by Erich McCoy. I remain at you rich. I am the Kino master. Uh, I'm the best. And Florian Himsel, where can we find you boys online? Check out Game Squid on YouTube, everyone. Woo. And E Rich, just don't even bother. Don't don't look for him anymore. <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this guy subscribed at tier two. I think that costs more money. Thank you, Dark Kurama. Um, nice. If you wanna check out this show before everybody else, we stream it live at twitch.tv slash monkey jones. Also, you can find us on YouTube, uh, iTunes, Podbean, wherever you find your podcast, you'll find Is It Kino. Uh, and we'll see you next time with, I guess, First Reformed. Unless, is there anything else that we need to cover in the coming weeks? Mm. Um, I don't think there's, there's anything, anything in the cinema. Hmm. I did want to watch that Velvet Bus song movie, but it's kind of no. bad. No, I don't care. There's, there's nothing that's going to be in the movie for me. Yeah, well. Unless the upside, I guess, but that. Too late. That um, movie's old news. Oh, no. <laughs> we'll see you next time, folks. Goodbye. Goodbye. Okay, we are now done kinoing. Back to the Twitch chat. Oh, man. Damn straight. Uh, actually, nah. I'm out. What, I what go yeah, these... yeah. Ebridge has to wake up in four hours, so let's let him go to bed. <laughs> the, what are all these uh... quotes people are putting in the chat? Uh, it's nothing for you. Know, <laughs> yeah, yeah, don't worry about it. <laughs> Yeah, oh, he reached in noobs. I'm gonna click on this. He pulled a beauty pie. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> wow! Yeah, I can't believe he said that. He reached. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> I didn't say the N word. He said. He said I it with. He said it with, he said it with a B. He said it with a B. Yeah, that was a B. Yeah. Oh no. The mighty B. I'm gonna have to listen to this too. Let's take a listen. To it. What exactly? Yeah, let's did play he it say? on repeat. Yeah, show me the. Uh, show me the R. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, I don't know what that was. Erich, get the fuck out of here before you say something else. All right, goodbye. <laughs> goodbye. <laughs> Erich has a pass. I got a pass. Yeah, he has a pass. Obama follows me on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> it's true, he does. Wow. All well, right. Uwe Ball follows me on Twitter. You have a Ball does? Can you get him on our show? I don't know. You should tweet at him. But I think I think he follows everyone back who who follows him. So no, just that's, do that, that's I guess. Sad. I don't know. I think Obama does it. Obama definitely does not do that. Well, doesn't he have like shitloads? He has of way more followers than he follows. Maybe he can't keep up. Let's have a look. <laughs> yeah, that's all he does is just fucking follow people all day. Well, it might be a bot to do that. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> It probably is. All right, let's turn the text to speech back dude, on. People really like dude, he's it. He's following 600K. How does he do it? Obama's following 600,000 people. 
Wait, is that? Why it even says fo following? Yeah. Like obviously he's not checking his feed. Why even have a Twitter at all at that point? Why even follow anybody? <laughs> he gets the power. Everyone talks about how they follow, how they are followed by him. Yeah. He he has eleven likes. Oh my god. He's following. Like a porn account, right? Like a like a gay sex toy account? Yeah, I, I would think more than one for 600k. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, oh. <laughs> that's, that's his only reason for using it, right? Mm. To get some hot deals on the next toy? <laughs> yeah. Hey, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Well, Florian, you just woke up. Do you want to hang out in a stream or do you want to get ready for the day? No, I'm I'm ready for the day. Okay. I'll I'll hang out. Okay. <laughs> we we had like uh, almost 500 people watching during the climactic moment where Black Panther did not win the Oscar. Man, you did watch it live. Why didn't you tell me? You were asleep. Which we, we we had no way of waking you up. You never gave us a phone number. You never gave us an address so I can call your neighbor to wake you up. I had no choice. What? No option. You could have told me before I went to sleep. Well, I didn't know until uh. Like the moment of, I was like, oh, fuck it. We'll stream the ending and see what's going on. Damn you. Oh, the ending only, right? Yeah, we only did like the last five categories. So how many times did Black Panda win then? It got three. It got costuming, uh, set design, and score. Meh. I I don't know. I guess I guess those generic things, they, it can win. Yeah. I mean, now they Marvel Cinematic Universe has three Oscars, and DC only has the one for Suicide Squad, so there you go. Oh, damn. How unbiased of these Oscars, huh? Yeah, it's almost like the Oscars are owned by Disney, and Marvel is owned yeah. by Disney. <laughs> you could almost think so. <laughs> really, it's my noggin joggin, Flory. <laughs> Yeah, they really should give it to, to DC just to be unbiased. DC hmm. wasn't even nominated. Aquaman Damn. didn't even get nominated for best uh, uh, special well, effects or whatever the fuck. Well, it shouldn't have been anyways. <laughs> it, man, it was like a, a CGI orgy. They put so many editing things into that. But I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm... well there's, there's a thing as, as putting in too much effort. And just, well, I guess that's not right, but it's just misguided effort. Yeah. Like, all of the stuff needed to be animated. Yeah. It was a big, it was a CGI nightmare. I, I could feel my brain melting as I watched the film. Yeah. <laughs> oh, God. Some kind of nefarious purpose, for sure. What, what did they try to brainwash into us? Hmm. I don't know. Hey, people in the chat, if you have anything you want to hear me and Florian talk about, hit us up, or just generally talk to us, because... Uh, I mean, that's what you're here for. <laughs> What's going on, fam? Yeah, when were you finally going to do this ice stream? Hmm. Good question. Uh, can <laughs> I can I stream time, Isaac instead of streaming Brad Dassey? <laughs> for 24 hours? Yes, please. Uh, I'll become the best at the game. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you only want me to stream it because it'll convince more people to buy it, and then you get an extra dollar every time somebody buys it. <laughs> yeah. I know your great. plan. You're trying to <laughs> trying to cash in. I'm finally tr wanting to to earn your respect by by you playing this game, and this is what you say. Oh, jeez. All right, Society Liver is a he's a subscriber, so I need you to do what he says, Florian. He wants you to say, I assume in German, diversity is our strength. Mm. <laughs> well, I don't know. I guess I don't disagree with that one. Well, so say it in German then. He doesn't even say it in German. Damn. I want to. I, I think a German accent should be saying this. This is just the thing. <laughs> uh, what is diversity even in German? I don't think I don't they know. have a word for it. <laughs> yeah, they probably don't. No. They don't believe mm. in it, I don't think. I don't know. It might just be diversity. Really? Nah, uh, well, there's a lot of English words, but let me huh. see. <laughs> let me oh. use Google Translate. It's very funny that. A German, a native German speaker does not know if there is a word for diversity. <laughs> Are it mock frei? What's that mean? Uh, let me see. Diversity. Wow, this is this is the dumbest word that it's translated it into. Oh Jesus! What they say? <laughs> oh, here we go. Vielfalt ist unsere Stärke. 
That, that, that's I can't believe that Field Fault would be diversity. Is that is that real? No, that can't be real. There's no way that would be what they use. I guess we we, we must not have a word for diversity. <laughs> that's fucked up. Based Germany. I mean, I guess it translates to diversity, but it doesn't seem like it's a diversity of race that we're talking about here. Well, diversity is our strength isn't necessarily about race. It's about diversity of ideas, of cultures, As of if. Uh, nationalities. <laughs> I mean, all all sorts of diversity make us stronger, Florian. Mm. Damn, well, I guess so. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what do you think is more powerful? Three long, powerful swords? Or one long, powerful sword, one knife, and one thumbtack. What is what's more powerful? <laughs> the consistency or the diversity? What oh is more? Boy. What is stronger? Tell me now. Well, I know if it's about sitting down on it, it might be the thumbtack that's best. You see, that's why diversity truly is our yeah. strength. If you're fighting a fat guy who often sits down, diversity <laughs> is our strength. <laughs> Diversity of oh, sexual no. partners? I don't date a girl unless she's fucked ten guys in the last week. <laughs> oh, wow. Diversity is the strength. How does sheep still do it? I guess you have to, she has to keep doing this for while she's dating you, otherwise you'll yeah. dump her. Why do you think I started a YouTube channel? It was just to convince fans to come over and uh, you know, I gotta prep those bowls, Florian. Somebody, uh, oh. Michael donated for us to talk about the cultural impact of High School Musical. Are you a big fan? I don't think I ever saw that. Yeah, I've never seen it either. <laughs> Next well, question. <laughs> G- great suggestion, Michael. I guess I guess we can't keen on it. No, Too bad. We never will. <laughs> Sheep is not uh, happy in the chat about what I've been saying. <laughs> cuck Key Jones. Yep, Mumkey is a cuck. That's right. Oh, man. Yeah, which one of these, these far-right parties do I support? Hmm. <laughs> uh, we don't well, need to discuss well, one that. of them sent to right but still <laughs> <laughs> no yeah carson i we haven't seen high school musical what you gonna do i yeah. bet it sucks and would you watch it with her <laughs> with with carson yeah uh, probably not there's a lot of movies i'd rather watch <laughs> it's high school Damn. kino <laughs> is you it really seen it. how can you tell <laughs> Uh, I mean, it's like a straight-to-Disney Channel movie. I don't think I need to see it. But but musicals are great. Hmm. Is the background music too loud compared to Florian, or can you hear everything okay, chat? Let me know. I'm playing a little bit of Rusty Cage music. Discuss the cultural importance of the binding of Isaac in internet culture. Have you noticed any internet <laughs> culture influenced by your game, Florian? I think there's some smileys every once in a while. Smileys? <laughs> some some Isaac smileys. You haven't noticed them? I, I guess I wouldn't recognize it because I don't know what it looks like. You don't know what Isaac looks like? No, Jesus. I don't. Dude, I haven't played your fucking stupid ass game. I bet it sucks dick. Yeah, you better play for 24 hours. <laughs> ah! There it is. There it is. You've seen this thing. This, uh, this, some people can't even hear the flash background toying music. Of wait. Isaac. Oh wait, that's that's you drew that. Well, no, Edmund did, but yeah, it's my game. And this is like an emoji that anybody can use on Twitch. Yeah, it's pretty common. Oh, cool, dude. What do you know? Yeah, I know, right? What an impact. <laughs> yeah, it is, dude. You, you helped design well, some shit. One day you're gonna watch Star Wars and you're gonna be surprised that I've the seen Star Wars, you missed. fuck. I've seen Star Wars. Which ones? I've seen um I've I saw three in theaters when it came out. I saw four, I saw five, and then all oh. the new ones, except for Rogue One. I uh, you kept saying you didn't see them. Oh, well, no. I mean I haven't seen one, two, six or rogue one. That's like almost half of them. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. Um, well, now I guess you, I guess now you just have bad taste rather than being oblivious How, to how's this. It, wait, I have bad taste because I haven't seen a movie. Well, because you decided not to see the rest of Star Wars. Yeah, I'll get around to it. I got a long life. <laughs> Man, you should do a marathon of it every every five years. I don't know. <laughs> mm, I'd rather marathon Back to the Future. Well, sure, I guess. 
I guess we could do that. Wait, who was I <laughs> talking to recently that said they haven't seen it? Was that you? Erich. Uh, oh, Erich hasn't seen it. We need to make him see it. We oh, he, he hasn't. It. I think he hasn't seen two and three, is what he said, right? No, he just hasn't seen three, I guess. Uh, oh, yeah, well, yeah, whatever. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> it's usually the one that I, uh, if I'm marathoning them, I'll be like, yeah, do I really want to watch the last one? <laughs> <laughs> Are you? Wow. Have I keynoted Zootopia? Uh, a long time ago, and this video is probably missing, but some people, old monkey fans might remember, I made a video pretending that I was a furry masturbating to Zootopia. So if anybody Whoa. can find that, it's like a minute long. Back on, uh, it, I think it was on the channel that got deleted. <laughs> Jeez. Yeah, she, Sheep Over remembers that one. I was like, I was talking about it normally, but then as it went on, you could hear a jerking off sound effect, and then I just started like coming <laughs> all over. Is that why it was deleted? <laughs> uh, I wonder if I can find it. I don't know where it would be. You could Ooh. Kino How to Train Your Dragon 3. Eh, I haven't seen any of them. Have you? Oh, wow. Yeah, sure I have, but uh, not just really. That sounds like a movie you and Erich would review on the Erich channel. <laughs> no, <laughs> Bernie, this is not the 24-hour stream. I'll be watching Brad Dassey for that. Well, we, we don't really watch new movies on the Erich channel. We're going to review Bad Boys 1 and 2. <laughs> oh, boy. Getting ready for that third one. Yeah, I can't wait. Have you seen Tom Green's movie Freddy Got Fingered? I have not seen that yet, but I do want to after <laughs> watching Tom Green on Big Brother. I really want to see wow. it. Wow. That movie's supposedly so bad, it might actually be good. Who knows? Yeah, that's, that's what I'm hoping for. I think it'll be secretly great. <laughs> yeah. I like underrated movies like that. Hmm. Furries are well, evil. We'll I tend to agree. What is your position on furries, Florian? Are they evil? <laughs> How are they evil? What are they doing? I mean, I guess the They're corrupting that... the youth with de degeneracy! I guess there are some evil ones that actually have sex with animals and dead animals. That's so all of them! Are... Every single one! That can't be all of them. All of them! <laughs> Jesus. If you, tr if you go to a pet store, you should have to, like get a background check of your internet search history before they let you buy an animal. <laughs> Killers, Jeez. thank you for subscribing. Welcome aboard. Yeah, Bedhead Bernie, I'll watch Freddy Got Finger. Don't worry. It's on the list. I gotta watch Avatar The Last Airbender, but I'm too busy watching fucking Brad Dassey instead! <laughs> yeah, if only you had done something that, that tells you to, to watch good stuff yeah. for, for 24 hours. Watch Avatar. Hmm. Oh, I guess that's good, yeah. Uh, oh, oh we have to review uh, Tyler Perry's uh, Medea's family funeral to prove that we're not racist. <laughs> yes, please. We, I think we keynoted the last Medea movie, so I don't see why we wouldn't do this one. You play an anthropomorphic mm. monkey too. I've never even heard of this. You've never heard of... Well, I, I guess they don't really bring Tyler Perry movies to Austria, do they? <laughs> I guess not. <laughs> Probably not. Not a big audience for it. I mean, I, I heard on it on the Kino, I, I, on the, the Inter... I don't think I ever saw it in the cinema. God, how's that even spelled? Medea? Hmm. Uh, M-A-D-E-A, -A, I think. It shows me some Baroque paintings. I don't know. What? <laughs> <laughs> Huh, I, maybe I spelled it wrong. Well, let's see. I guess I'll just add family funeral, and there we go. Oh, it's spelled the same way as that Baroque painting. Okay. Florian, what do you think of uh, anime was made to punish the U.S. Uh, to punish us for the atomic bombs? It's a pretty good punishment. Yeah. <laughs> Man, anime's great. These these fucking anti weebs. Hmm. Yeah, did you read any more Alita since we talked about it this morning? Yeah, it's still going on about that fucking motorball. It's crazy. How long till she finally fu sees those those real villains that were controlling it all, supposedly, even though it's not been mentioned yet in the comics, so I don't even know if there's any such real villains to come. I'm guessing the comic has come to an end by now, right? How old is this? Like, 20 years old? Oh, yeah, it, it only ran for five years, but I Back still have... Back in the 90s, I assume? Yeah. Yeah. I, I I think it has like ten volumes and I've only read three so far. Ah oh, shit. You reading them online? Uh somewhat. Wait, what, what do you mean somewhat? Did you order some of the books too? 
<laughs> Maybe. <What are> you... <laughs> no, I'm reading it online. Uh, it's nothing to be ashamed of. I mean, if I had the books, I'd read them that way. Yeah, I mean, I guess, but... How, how big could they be, these books? I mean, they'd probably be like like 10 books, and then you read them once, and then what? <laughs> I mean, have you ever had an anime book before? Surely you have some in your house, right? Oh, surely. <laughs> you, you, you never had a, a physical manga in your hand? I got a whole bunch no. of them I can show you. Wow. I can show you what they look like, dude. They're not that big. Well, how, how, how much is there? What, which ones are they? Because if you, if you have anything like like Berserk, that thing has like 600 chapters. Can you imagine? Oh, well, he's gone, I guess. <laughs> yeah, but you talking shit? Look. <laughs> yeah. Look, oh. it's, it's not that big. It's, uh, it's moderately sized. It's like 200 pages and it's all pictures. Well, 200 pages, that's not a lot. I no, mean, 10 yeah. volumes is going to be... I don't know, like 2,000 pages? I think when I was a kid and I got like each new issue of Yu-Gi-Oh! I think I finished <laughs> it in like 80 minutes. So it was all, <laughs> oh, it, no. like it was barely worth the eight bucks that my mom had to spend for each one. I know, it's such a weird thing that they that they make them in books because there's just too much of it. It won't fit in books. Oh yeah, <laughs> like if, you, if you're a collector of One Piece or Naruto, you're fucked. There's no room in your house for all those books. <laughs> Well, I mean, it's just enough for one of those, but if you if you do both of them, then... Yeah. Actually, it would, it... wait. No, I guess they've got, like, 800 chapters as well. Do they do they have collections, or is it all single books? <laughs> uh, I have I have all of Death Note in one big book, but that wouldn't work for anything any longer, I don't think. Yeah, Death Note's pretty short, I guess. Unless they, they shortened it for the anime. I think it's, like... I don't know, like 66 chapters, maybe? No, well, that know. does seem more... I don't think they have 66 episodes. In the, well, I don't think each episode is a chapter. <laughs> yeah, the anime had like yeah, 27 episodes, yeah. It would have to be absolutely perfectly written to, to, to make one episode per, per chapter. <laughs> Death Note was 108 chapters? Yeah. Doesn't One Piece do that? Isn't One Piece each chapter is its own episode? I'm not sure. I think it might be. I mean, they, they at least have that many episodes, annoyingly. So it, it'll take them fucking forever to finally dub them into, into <laughs> yeah. English. Uh, I don't know if One Piece will ever be entirely dubbed in English. Uh, uh, we well, might be probably. waiting another two decades for that to happen. Are you waiting for two? Um, oh, wait, no, you probably don't watch it. I watched it up until he beat Crocodile. And then I don't know why I stopped, but I don't feel like Probably getting back into it. because there was no more dub. <laughs> Probably, yeah, and also I was like 13. <laughs> oh no, well, then there was definitely no more dub. <laughs> yeah. No, One Piece Man. is going to end in like a year or two, because he's, didn't he say he's going to end it at chapter 1000? Oh, damn, I hope so. I hope they can finally focus on dubbing it, god damn it. <laughs> Do you really like One Piece that much? <laughs> Oh yeah, One Piece is great. I just really hate the the Japanese voices. I hate them so much. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, why don't you just read it as it comes out each week? Uh, well, I guess I could do that. Yeah, I guess I probably should have done that. Yeah, you get know, thirteen whole so pages every week. Wow, what a thrill! I mean, that's that's pretty good. If you if you read Berserk, that thing never comes out. I think it might have been a year since the last release. And and it's just as slow as <laughs> I mean it, it it's it's just as many chapters as One Piece. What about Dead Man Wonderland, where the lady got pregnant and decided to stop writing it, and it ends on a cliffhanger, and then I think she <laughs> she never came back to it. Damn! What a cursed child. <laughs> that, that's what I've heard. I don't know if that's confirmed, but that's what I read. I never read that one though, so I don't know. I just watched it when it was on Adult Swim. And I was like, wow, that's a shitty ending. Let's see how it actually ends. And then they said, oh, no, it doesn't end. <laughs> they just gave up. Damn. That's just like how I wanted to see how Alita ends. And then I, I, I downloaded the anime and it, it ends in the same place. Damn. <laughs> As the movie? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh. It, it might even end sooner. I think it ends where he falls off the pipe. <laughs> Can't wait to experience that again. <laughs> yeah. You ever hear of a manga called 
Liar Game, I think is what it's called. Sorry, there's so many mangas, Jesus. Yeah, well, there's like a million of them. Yeah, I'm trying to I mean, think of ones that I've actually read that you might have seen. Hmm. Hmm. Damn, I what should. What about uh, Pretty what? Face? You ever read Pretty Face? No. Damn it. I wonder, uh, I wonder if there's a space dandy manga. Hmm. Probably. Yeah, I guess okay. so. I so guess all this stuff thing. is based I on mangas, isn't Trump. it? He makes us all look like backwards idiots. And the fact the robot actually reads the cuss words even when it are. filters it out. He's making <laughs> Jeez. for years. Well, I, would be I guess you're gonna get terminated. Ah. Every and I was just uh, them saying I fucking hate Trump. Mm. Wait, oh, it's it's it senses it to puppy and then it. But then it actually it anyway. says fuck yeah. <laughs> oh no. Well, I guess you should try to. Maybe you can change the order of of the way it does things, so it it'll read it in the censored way. Ah, I don't. I don't really care what the robot says. <laughs> <laughs> Once they make a filter for everything, every cuss word, they'll probably pick up the robot ones the easiest. <laughs> so you better watch out. Uh oh. <laughs> robot recognized robot. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. Have you read? Have you read the Rick and Morty comic? No, I didn't know they had one. Is it better than the show? Eh, no, but it's all right. Do you just read it all in their voices? Every woman in the house <laughs> oh god, room. no. Hey, yeah, the robot's reading again. I bust a. Womb. Womb, the only thing I want to hear from you is stroking and choking and I got two blasts. Okay, an actual womb. Isaac, you think that I'm joking? That's a good song. It's nice to hear that song from a woman's perspective, Michael. Thank you so much. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Not that burger song, Jesus. I ever do the fedora emoji in the chat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what that emoji's called. Yeah. Oh man, will they release a new Rick and Morty comic yet? Hmm. Well, at least, at least they've been releasing it steadily, unlike the show. <laughs> uh, I think they're working on like a. 100 episode order of Rick and Morty, right? It's gonna start coming out way more frequent, I think. God, I wish that would be amazing. That's what's going on, but I'm scared if they well, can if they can barely I mean, make 10 good episodes a year. How are they gonna do 80 of them all at once? That's fucked. Yeah, I, I guess it's gonna become Nick. like Simpsons, dear. <laughs> that, that won't ever happen. I mean, it's all about the writing, and they could just hire more writers. I don't care about the animation quality that much. Well, that's why it takes so long, is that they're drawing it, as uh, he famously said. Oh, well, damn. How's my viewing of the Passion series coming along? I'm doing it two episodes as, at a time now, so uh, I guess the next episode of Passage comes out Monday night, and then I'll probably watch it and record my review on Tuesday, so expect uh, the next two episode reviews on well not actually not this tuesday because i'll be doing something else <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, no. expect i guess on a wednesday or thursday yeah i'm fine well, anyway, i watched the passage too i, I could be on one of those hmm, well, if you want it's uh it's a pre-recorded show it's not like a twitch I show know. yeah it's pretty pretty well edited and everything oh well i guess i i won't fit in there no no <laughs> No diversity being our strength. <laughs> Just me. Yeah, Monkey Box no. 2 is overdue, but what are you going to do? I don't know. <laughs> Takes a lot of work. Yeah. Got lots is of other shit to do. Is that a non-smoking sign behind you? Um, No, it's a gun-free zone sign co oh. covered in the blood of a man who was shot by a gun. Beautiful. Yeah. Because it'd be pretty weird to hang a, a non-smoking sign in your own house for yourself. I have to remind myself <laughs> to stop smoking so much. Yeah. I have a real problem. <laughs> Damn. It'll kill you. <laughs> Before I kill myself. Yeah, we wouldn't want that. <laughs> no. Why can't I listen to this Rusty Cage music for 24 hours? That'd be nice. 
Yeah, I bet that would be neat. But then again, maybe you'd hate it at the end. Hmm. I don't know. This song is infinitely listenable, I've found. I've listened to it for hours on end while working on stuff. Really? The same song? I mean, it's just like the ultimate background music, dude. You gotta check it out. Which one is it? Uh, I think on YouTube it's called Rusty Cage Background Music. I'll look it up. Unicorn, oh, bunny, okay. mother, we have the robot rainbows, talking mother, again. Mother, butterfly, joyful flowers, unicorn, noise, noise. Ah, she's reading noise. the the sensors one, two, now. One, two, three. That's weird. Smoking, weed, drinking, beers, doing coke. Damn. Weird. I guess the AI is evolving. Weird. Weird. She like Rolling she censors fatty, half of them. Blunt. I wonder how she decides. Who smokes the blunt. <laughs> I guess she really defends from the N word. <laughs> yeah, if you search Rusty Cage background music, it's the first song that pops up. Oh uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Wow. That's a great song. I've heard this before. I didn't know it was Rusty Cage. <laughs> yeah. He's a true artist. He made something that was valuable. He didn't make some shitty video game. Uh, Boring. Are you using this in your videos a lot? This, this yeah. Music? Yeah, I use this in like every video now. I still look for him. <laughs> he says he's going to stop using it because now it's associated with me. He's going to make his own music again. <laughs> And he's gonna monetize all your videos. Oh uh -oh. wait, you're not on YouTube. Yeah. Damn. And my videos aren't monetized anyway. When is the <laughs> next depression chamber? I don't really plan yeah. those ahead of time, but it could be any time other than Tuesday. <laughs> you don't have a schedule? Oh damn. No, maybe I should get one, but I've got like so many different shows I do, it'd be hard to schedule all of them. It's just like, what am well, I in the mood for? Welcome to Depression Monday with Monkey. <laughs> we everybody does get depressed on Mondays. That's true. I think well, it'd be me. better for like a Sunday night because I think the most depressing time of the week is Sunday night, as you're anticipating going to work or school the next day. Man, I'm anticipating until the stores open again. I can buy food, and I don't have to work on Monday. That seems pretty good. Wait, stores are closed on Sunday there? Oh yeah, you don't have that. Yeah, it's pretty crazy. The whole we country got, shuts down on Sunday? Yeah. There's only one store that's open on Sunday, and it's the one at the train station. It's really bizarre. What? That's like yeah, I guess the most convenient day for people to do their shopping is when they're all closed, <laughs> and then you have to go to work and you don't have time to shop? What the fuck? Well, I mean, people obviously buy on other days. What? Yeah, Saturday. You have to go to work every other day. Saturday must be a well, busy Saturday. as hell day. I guess Saturday used to be half the day off. I don't know if they. What if they the have fuck? The day. <laughs> what are you guys, a socialist I think they might country? Have the whole day by now. This Maybe is... they have like an hour earlier off. This is the most <laughs> bullshit I've ever heard. Yeah, tell me about it. <laughs> so you just. If you forget to go shopping on Saturday, you can just starve to death on Sunday. Well, it takes usually like half a year to starve to death, but sure. <laughs> half a year? Well, me anyways. He might be a few months, but still. Do they still deliver your favorite pizza on Sunday? Oh, yeah, and restaurants are open. Oh, okay, just grocery stores. I, I guess the restaurants must love it because more people go to them. Yeah, and I guess... I, I think they might even get double pay on, on those days because of more oh, worker rights, so who I, knows? I could use some double pay. If anybody wants to double pay me on Patreon, hook me up. <laughs> Patreon.com <laughs> slash monkey, baby. Hey. Double pay oh, Sunday, boy. hey. It's the price you're asking for Streamlabs. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's the... Uh, I don't know. I've been watching an unhealthy amount of Wings of Redemption. And uh, I've, I've seen firsthand how uh, cringy and sad it is when a streamer is just sitting there doing nothing and asking people to give him money. So I, I've been trying to not openly beg for donations and shit because it's so fucking sad to see. You literally just did something. You recorded this this Kino podcast. It's one of your best podcasts, isn't it? Uh, some might say. Brandy got blacked 32 odd times. <laughs> I love it. I love. What does uh, it mean? It's uh, Wings of Redemption's ex girlfriend Brandy got blacked. <laughs> oh boy. I love every single Wings of Redemption meme. <laughs> <laughs> and, like it's even when they're not funny. I just recognize it and it makes me smile. Either subscribe, oh, actually, donate, or get the fuck out. Is he actually enjoyable to, to listen to? Yes, because every stream, people are constantly fucking with him. So it's just like, you're always anticipating what's going to happen next. That's insane. Yeah, it's, wow. it's fun. 
And then there, like there are there are like five YouTube channels dedicated to every single stream. They will make a highlights <laughs> reel. So oh you, no! So you, you don't even have to watch his streams. You can just watch the twelve minutes of highlights every single day. Would you like to be a lol cow like that? I think I. Well, it takes a special state of mind to be a lol cow, and I think I would embrace <laughs> it too much. I think I would make the YouTube channel and make highlights of myself. So it's like. <laughs> I, I can intentionally do dumb shit on stream and then profit from it on YouTube. So I think he's doing it the wrong way. I think he should make one of these troll channels and just make his own compilations and earn that ad revenue. Well, damn. But, but I guess he probably doesn't have any talent to do that. Yeah, he's pr he's pretty he's good, good at uh, uh, first-person shooter video games. <laughs> the, the most important genre of all. <laughs> I mean, I don't know. He's, he's not bad. Shout out Wendy's Chili. <laughs> <laughs> According to him, Wendy's chili is part of his uh, doctor's recommended diet for losing oh, weight. Man. Well, that's pretty good. Yeah. <laughs> I should try that, the chili diet. <laughs> <laughs> Wendy's chili specifically. Oh, is that especially bad? <laughs> I stopped watching you and you stopped doing anime reviews. How the fuck did you find this? It's been like three years, dude. How'd you find this? It's been for fucking ever. I stopped doing that shit like years before I even lost my YouTube channel. Well, now he's just skulking on Twitter and just goes on whatever pops up, and that's how he found it. I was still living in Iowa when I finished I like Monkey's Anime Reviews. I meant to say Twitch. <laughs> oh. Did you move a lot? Or just once? Uh, I moved... No, I, I moved to North Carolina, and then we moved out of that little apartment after a while and moved into this house. Mm, cool. Moving up in the world, huh? Yeah, <laughs> can man. Can you sustain it? I, I, uh, here, don't have... no, my, no. my whole life I lived in a shitty fucking trailer, and I always dreamed of living in a two-story house, and now I'm doing it. So, Damn. That's great. I said, fuck so you, you mom and to... dad. Fuck this trailer. I'm going to live in a house. <laughs> That's one house stacked on top of another. And now I'm doing it. My downstairs is... Do you have to move is the as, now? Uh, well, we, we pay a neighborhood kid to do it. Oh, neat. Yeah. Even, I guess he can control when he's noisy. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah, yeah, exactly, yeah. Damn. I guess that's pretty cool. Wow, living the life. The white picket fence and everything. <laughs> you lost your channel, buddy. Where the fuck have you been? You missed a lot. Yeah, Nam. If only you could have promoted your Twitch on that channel before it was destroyed. Hmm. Well, the Twitch wouldn't exist if the channel was still there, I don't think. Oh, uh, yeah, damn. My house is what just two trailers nailed on top of each other. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, it's like that Ready Player One village. <laughs> oh, yeah. That village did not end up very well in the movie, if you'll remember. I think it... <laughs> It got 9-11 pretty bad. <laughs> yeah, 9-11 by drones. <laughs> that's that's going to be the next 9-11 is drone strikes. Yeah, how, how long till the, the terrorists use drones, man? How is anyone going to stop them? They've got to already be doing... I mean, technically, the US government has been using drones to terrorize innocent people for about a decade now, so I guess the terrorists technically already have been doing that. Yeah, well, We've been terrorizing your drones. people, Florian. Those aren't my people. You said you're Iranian, didn't you? <laughs> Iraqi, but yeah. It's the same thing. But yeah, fuck those people, man. Whoa! I don't, I, I, don't, I, I wouldn't have any pre good feelings towards them based on my dad be dad. Oh, yikes. <laughs> it's not your fault, Florian. It's not your fault. No, it's their fault, damn it. <laughs> it's not your fault. <laughs> it's not your fault. It might be Dick Cheney's fault. Hmm. Oh, well. After you watched Vice, maybe. Maybe Dick Cheney's why your dad hates you. <laughs> oh, I don't think he hates me. I just hate him. Oh, oh well. Oof. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. I mean, I, I guess he, he, he tried to get in contact. You know, he doesn't even speak proper German, so he'd just be really weird to hang out, hang out with. Well, you don't sit around speaking English all day with all your Austrian friends? Well, I assume he's even worse at English. Well, what fucking language does he speak? Well, I don't know. Like... Arabic? I Iraqi and, and Kurdish. 
Do you not even speak the same language as your father? But do I speak Iraqi and Kurdish? No. You don't? How do you? Jesus, what a, have you what ever talked to him in your life? Be. Well, he does speak some broken German, and I, I, I could talk uh, to him back in the day. I don't how know. did he even get in bed with your mom if he, they didn't speak the same language? Now, he does speak it. It's just a really disgusting accent <laughs> and, and some broken, broken grammar. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I mean, you know how how bad immigrants can be when they when they learn English, but German is so hard to learn it. It's it's so much worse. Nine nine nine. <laughs> That's all you need to know. Yeah. I learned all the German I know watching Hitler documentaries. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Constantly watching Hitler, huh? Damn. All kinds of Hitler speeches. Das ist no. mein Dank, Weiten Dank, das Juden! <laughs> uh, you, you ever watch those, those remixes where he's performing <laughs> pop songs? No. <laughs> that sounds great, though. Oh, man, you, you're gonna watch the one where he does We Are Number One? That one's great. <laughs> Hitler is? Yeah. <laughs> 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 it's, a, it's a classic and I'm, I'm, I'm so sad I can't watch it anymore because it's blocked in, in German regions but you can watch it are oh, you lucky man uh, you can use uh, NordVPN brought to you by <laughs> yeah I'm surprised you didn't take that NordVPN sponsorship probably would have been really good hmm. yeah oh, well. could have sold the fuck out yeah, you probably would have made so much money with your loyal fans. I, I don't think any of my fans would ever sign up for a VPN based on my ad. I mean, I don't know if anyone would because it sounds like a hassle, but I don't know. They seem to be pretty monetarily involved. <laughs> you never know. Yeah, but VPNs are expensive and giving me $2 is cheap and easy. Who is more likely to come back? Digi, Biggs, Manimal, Psy, or Asperger? What do you mean come back? They all still exist. You mean like come, come back? Come back to you. To, what, what does that entail? Like doing it, videos it, with me? Entails coming home. Uh, I think Biggs is the most likely answer because I'm going to a concert with him in three months. So I guess Biggs. I guess you've had the, the longest time to forgive him, huh? <laughs> I mean, I... I generally forgive people almost immediately i don't i try not to hold grudges i like to make fun of people for being lol cows but like i, I don't yeah. have i don't think i have hard feelings against really any of these people would you join the pcp again if they if they'd offer it yeah i probably would damn they really should yeah, they're well, missing I, out uh is the uh, is the podcast still up to par you mean is it good yeah is it good yeah, it's all right. Oh, there you go. They don't need me. <laughs> oh, no, but it'd be better. <laughs> Sorry, Michael. No nipple pics on, on Twitch. It's bad enough E. Rich is dropping the N-bomb all over. <laughs> you want to talk? You, you're quoting Holocaust slogans earlier. What? I was just reading what the chat said. <laughs> In German? <laughs> I don't know what it said. <laughs> what does it say? Well, you said labor makes free ones. Labor makes free ones? No, not, not once. What you said it once, I assume. But what does it mean? Well, it's what they they wrote at the concentration camps. It's labor makes free. Labor makes free. That's not so it's bad. It's the lie they they told the Jews. Oh, whatever, they, man. They, they didn't get free from from working in those concentration. Yeah. Camps. Okay. Okay. The big lie. It's not that offensive. <laughs> oh, maybe no. maybe in your culture here we actually believe that labor sets you free. <laughs> oh jeez. The government tells us that every fucking day. <laughs> Damn. Yeah. What do you know? Yeah. The thing that the Nazis to told to the Jews? No wonder why I never learned that in school because they actually want us to believe that. <laughs> Damn. Mom, can yeah, you start a new PCP with Jeff? <laughs> I've never talked to Jeff. Wait, Geoff? Wow. Is that his name, Geoff? No, I don't know. It's just I, I didn't know that that's how you would spell Jeff. That's crazy. He sent me a DM once on Twitter, and I ignored it. <laughs> <laughs> and I oh, did no. not respond. Well, that was it. All you had to do was respond to that. He was best friends with some weird anime guy. Hmm. Nah, that's okay. Uh, <laughs> no, thanks. <laughs> yeah. Turns out all, all my uh, anime-obsessed friends uh, don't stay friends for too long. 
Yeah, because you constantly ridicule the hobby. Mm. <laughs> That's true. I mentioned your well, name that... once in a corrupting your kids live stream, and they threatened to ban me. What's corrupting your kids? Mm, I think that must be a PCP thing. No, oh, I've never heard of that one. Yeah, I'm not sure. I don't think I ever saw it. Could be a Munchie thing. Now, M Munchie would not threaten to ban anybody for discussing me. Munchie is uh, he's a good boy. He didn't do nothing. Oh, oh no. Well, damn. <laughs> Boogie died. Press F in chat. You know what to do, folks. <laughs> Spam the F. Yeah. Man, what if he really dies? Now we'll never know. Yeah, the day People Boogie dies will be a, a very confusing day to be a streamer. <laughs> yeah. Everyone will continue doing that lame meme. No. Well, I guess he'll never die now. He'll just get skinny. And then he'll live forever. You really think he's gonna get skinny? I guess. I mean, he, he can't eat that much, so I don't know how does he stay fat. I guess I don't know Boogie's diet. Well, he, he had a surgery, so he can't eat much, you know? And so did Wings of Redemption! He still eats all oh. that Wendy's chili! <laughs> How is that why? Because it's liquid? Damn. Yeah, he's on, he's on a liquid diet, so they call him Liquid Richard. <laughs> and he just said his name is not Richard, so it makes it even funnier. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Oh man. The chat is now nothing but <laughs> comments about Bookie dying, so we're gonna need some no! help. No! What have I done? <laughs> Liquid Richard actually makes music. Yeah, me and Sheep listened to one of the albums the other day. It's a great album. It's called Ban World. Yeah. Fantastic album, truly. Big ups, to Liquid Richard. Oh, sweet. You already put Alita Battle Angel on. On YouTube. Yeah, and on my website, monkeyjones.tv. Much more important place to watch it, even though it gets a fraction of a percentage of the views. On the website? Damn. Yeah. <laughs> oh, well. What a shame. It's okay. We'll be fine. It's never okay, damn it. Florian, I hoped your website would be great. Florian, do you know how to say the word black in Spanish? I sure do. <laughs> <laughs> well, there's the answer to your question, I guess. <laughs> I don't know why you started giggling about that. I mean, it's just a, just a normal word that every uh, Spanish-speaking child knows from the age of three. So I don't know why it's <laughs> such a comedic moment for you. Oh, man, people get offended when they hear that word. I don't know why. <laughs> Corrupting Your Maybe Kids not. is basically hosted by all the girlfriends of the PCP crew. Sheepover oh, is hotter than all of them, by the way. That's funny. Damn. Easy meme. Thank you for the three months. Whoa, you might be the first three-month repeater on subscribing. Thank you so much. Damn, has it been exactly three months? Amazing. Uh, It might be. Did I start this on Christmas? I don't know. Well, I, I think he got banned in on like the 10th of, of December, so probably. Mm. What a shame. I don't know how it is three months. I haven't even had this Twitch channel for three months. That doesn't make any sense. Well, you don't have to wait for it to run out before you subscribe again, I think. I mean, that'd be bad if they'd make you wait. <laughs> yeah, He can't buy it yet. Gotta wait for it to run out. Now, Twitch wants that money because they get half of it. Yeah. Half? Jesus. Yeah. I mean, I know YouTube takes a lot, but half? Oh, my God. Yeah. Well, at least the, <laughs> the Streamlabs, I get all of it. Well, yeah, not better. all of it, but close. No, I get all of it. There's no way you get all of it. Streamlabs Why doesn't take any of it. Why would they do it for free? I, I have no idea. I, I think that they their service like provides other things, but I don't know. Like maybe people pay for a premium stream labs, maybe they sell merchandise. I have no idea how it works. I'm pretty sure they take like five percent. I'm I'm telling you, I, I get the whole thing. Damn. Yeah. Well maybe they, I, I'm they pretty add fucking 5%. sure. Maybe they add five percent to the purchase for the for the buyer. Maybe. I mean maybe. 
Uh, PayPal always takes a cut, though, so that's what sucks. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. Can't you do it with wire? I guess not, because it'd be too much. Hmm. I guess PayPal's probably best for small stuff anyways. Hmm. Yeah, PayPal's okay. Until they ban people. PayPal's cuts them in. PayPal likes to ban people for their political opinions, though, so... Whatever. Well, I, I have no opinion on that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I I have no no sympathy for those culture warriors that get banned. I mean, that's way worse than what you did. Oh yeah, I'm a good donator <laughs> since I only donate through Streamlabs. Yeah, thank you, Michael. You're a real human <laughs> being and a real hero. Oh, doesn't waste his money. Waste? Twitter, what do you Twitch. mean waste? Who who do you think paid for this Lacroix? <laughs> Michael did. I know, but if they if they use the the Twitch subscription, they, they waste half of it, oh, don't they? Yeah, yeah, you're right. <laughs> Michael's keeping me hydrated. He's a hero. Oh, man. Get those drinks, huh? No. That's right. I'm a thirsty boy. My mom has been telling me all my life I'm thirsty. I didn't know what she meant until now. <laughs> Is LaCroix expensive? Not really. It's like less than five bucks for 12. It's about as expensive as any soda. I don't even know what that is. It's just like flavored water. Oh, well that's that makes sense. Yeah. But, but that would be any any drink. <laughs> uh, I guess you're technically right. Other than maybe <laughs> milk. Well, I mean it is still flavored, but yeah. Yeah, but there's no water in milk, is there? Like it's not this, this water and everything. But but milk is like its own thing. It's it doesn't start off as water and then you mix in the milk powder to make it milk. It comes but out of cows a cow. Obviously milk. drink water. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. I don't think milk, milk counts as water. Yeah, it's cow oh, cum. Jesus. Are traps gay? Good question. The answer is it's only gay if the balls touch. Yeah, I mean I'm sure every liquid has water in it, but milk at no point is like water that you then mix other things into. It, it's it's 95% water. Oh my god. What, what's the other 5%? Milk. <laughs> what the fuck does that mean? As meme, no, thank you no. so much. You're a real no. human being and a real hero. Well, the rest is protein, sugar, fat, and vitamins, I guess. Huh. <laughs> All I mean, I'm yeah, saying I is... LaCroix starts off as normal water, and then you add the flavoring. Soda starts off as normal water, then you add shit. Milk is always milk. You never take no. water and turn it into milk. What? Are you, of course you do. The cows drink water. They don't drink milk. That, the, the process of... <laughs> that, no, you're wrong. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> a, a cow is not a, a kitchen appliance <laughs> that you insert water in one end, and then milk comes out the other. Well, it is, but it still doesn't matter because if you add something and and then you add ninety percent water, you basically added that something to water. <laughs> so is a uh, is a newborn baby water since it's mostly comprised of water? Well, it's not ninety percent water though. It's like seventy percent. Yeah, sure. Yeah, <laughs> just humans I mean, are water. Yeah. I mean, Any, anything with water in it is now water. I mean, yeah, you, you basically have water in the womb, and then you add, like, one <laughs> cell to it, and then it grows into a baby. Maybe in your fancy Iowa kitchens, a cow isn't an appliance. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Michael wants to know when I'm having auditions to replace Asperger. Oh, man. So I need a big, fat, bearded retard who never does what I pay him to do on time. <laughs> And uh, is is pretty funny. Who can I replace? Oh, that sounds like a great job. Mm, I I better I better audition for that one. Oh, uh, you really? Okay. Uh, auditions <laughs> are taking place at my house tomorrow night. Oh shit! I don't want to travel. No. <laughs> All right. Well, you, you gotta. I'm the Asperger out. way is to throw is to move across the country to live with your best friend and to work with him, and then after two months, give up and move in instead with a girl you just met. <laughs> And then, and then beat her up a month later, get arrested, and then wonder where it all went wrong. That's the Asperger way. Well, that does sound pretty good. Damn. I'm not going to say the biggest mistake of his life was moving away from Mumkey, 
but it was probably the biggest mistake of his life. Fuck you, Michael. I can donate more. Uh, that... His biggest mistake so far. <laughs> Is that a Simpsons movie quote? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I am a fat bearded retard, but I actually do things like work and go to college. You are overqualified, my friend. <laughs> Damn. G.I. Joe, what's the significance of 268? Is it just a random number? Mm, I guess. 168 is the monkey number. <laughs> but thank you, G.I. Joe. If you were forced to commit an act of terrorism against any entity... Who slash what would you target? I've actually been thinking about this just today. Oh, no. I, I thought if I could exterminate and commit a genocide against Holy one shit. against one group, it would be against ants. There, are, There's no, no – not not like your aunt and uncle, Florian, like the little bugs Whoa. that crawl around. If they didn't exist, I would be so fucking happy. We have to buy so many ant traps, put them in our kitchen – Put them in the floor outside our house. I hate them. I hate ants so much. I don't care if it would destroy the ecosystem or whatever the fuck. I don't care what animals eat ants. I want them to no longer exist. I hate ants so Man, much. I'd rather you kill my ant than all of ants. That's crazy. <laughs> What's wrong with your ant? Well, a lot. But also ants are really cool, damn you. Can you imagine a worse nightmare than waking up and your entire body is covered in fire ants? <laughs> Fucking just <laughs> kill me. Happen. Just fucking kill me. It could happen if I don't exterminate them. If I don't genocide all ants, that could happen. It's within the realm of possibility. What do you even do against ants? Is there like an animal that you could use? You, I buy a shit ton of poison and now my whole house is covered in poison to stop these ants from crawling in my kitchen and shit. Yeah, I was talking about something sensible that you could do. Oh, well. Sensible? You go to Home Depot or I guess... Uh, what do they call it? Their concentration camp depot? And you just... Yeah, clearly. <laughs> they call it Bauhaus. Thank you, Skunky. Skunky just gave me $15 to buy booze. Thank you, Oh, Skunky. actually, you want to know what you do against ants? Uh, tell your uncle to go home? Damn. Now, now what you do is you, you take <laughs> the... This is a real thing that my, my grandma used to do, by the way. You, you take the, 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 the green stem of... Of tomatoes and they hate that I mean I, I hate it too but I guess they hate it more and they they'll stay away from that I think they also hate cinnamon or something because when we had them in our house I think it was cinnamon we like put some um, in front of the hamster cage so that they couldn't get in there and they like stayed the fuck away from it wait so you knew to use cinnamon well that's cool well I, I think we googled it I mean that's definitely less disgusting than the, the tomato leaves <laughs> yeah. or, or stems. <laughs> yeah, and then you, your hamster smells like cinnamon. It's a great deal. Yeah. Instead of smelling like her own piss and shit like she always does. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Let the ants crawl down your urethra. No, thank you, human. <laughs> no, thank you. Jeez. The only thing crawling down my urethra is a fork. <laughs> what? Oof. We're into some Jeez. freaky shit in this household, Florian. No. <laughs> you never stuck a fork inside yourself? <laughs> what were you doing with the other prongs? Ah! Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, so penis is so ah! small. <laughs> yeah, it's some intense sounding, you're goddamn right. Is that what it is that what it sounds like? Ah! <laughs> yeah, I should have said a, right I should have said a needle. I don't know why I said fork. <laughs> Needle would be much easier to do it. Uh, I guess you, you guess you have to use the wide end of the fork. If it... <laughs> yeah, I don't know if I could do that. Well, depends how wide. <laughs> how wide your urethra is? No, the fork. <laughs> well, actually, <laughs> probably both. I think I've seen videos of of people putting the whole finger in. So I you guess know I what? Don't know. You know what? We've gone too far. <laughs> I don't need to. <laughs> oh, those gifts are great. Dude. I don't need to hear about the videos that you watch in your free time. <laughs> Oof. Man, you, you ever do a disgusting image search where, where, where two people have to find the most disgusting picture to make the other guy sick? No, I just I see these pictures by accident by browsing 4chan every day. <laughs> by accident, huh? No. Well, I'm not seeking them out. It's just like, hey, guys, look at this thing I want to show you. Oh, great. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks Cursed for posting images. this in this thread when we're talking about uh, anything else. 
That's what you get when everyone's anonymous. Ah. Yes, that's why I love it. <laughs> you do want to see it. I knew it. You ever go through the offended page on Encyclopedia Dramatica? <laughs> no. Uh, if you want to do another face cam video, and I know, <laughs> I, no. I, I know reaction videos are a bit old, but just record yourself scrolling through Encyclopedia Dramatica slash offended. I think you'll really enjoy it. Well, damn. I think I'll do it now just to see. You ever put an ant in your urethra and launch it with piss? <laughs> <laughs> Clearly. Hey, okay, are you on the offended page? I want to hear you scroll through it. Oh, man. Let's, let's see. Offended? Question mark? They might have changed it over the years, but it, sh it should still be good. And it, it links to offended, no question mark. It's just cute animals, oh no. Oh, oh, I see. I see. <laughs> Keep going, it goes on for like 20 minutes. Mmm. Harlequin, baby, yes. <laughs> oh, Jesus, that's some, some bad disease she's got, oh my god. Oh, a whole flayed human leg, sure. <laughs> okay, I can't do this. Oh, you oh, made it oh, like 10 seconds. A festering penis. Yeah, okay, I've seen enough. <laughs> Man, me and my <laughs> friends did that shit when we were 14. You're like 30. Oh, no. You gotta be a man. <laughs> well, it seems like you have to be a boy. <laughs> True, good point. We were very young. You wanna and do I, it? I've you done it, but it. I've done it. But isn't it updating? Oh, Carson, Wait, why did you go to it, Carson? It's not for you. <laughs> it's she offended. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's to, it's to punish people who get offended. It's not meant to offend. It's meant to disgust. Like, what? So why does it start with cute animals? <laughs> because it, it's a horrible trick. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How long does it go? For like, it, it, you can scroll for like 20 minutes to get through all of it. <laughs> oh no. It's got some good uh, shit in there. <laughs> Literally shit. Yeah, the, the finest shit. Oh no. <laughs> What's the page called? It's Encyclopedia Dramatica, the offended page. How is the page not banned? Because it's on Encyclopedia Dramatica. They don't ban anything. I'm not posting <laughs> the link. Google it. <laughs> I'm not posting that fucking link. <laughs> oh, man. That, that's a good website. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, you had to send it to E-Rich. <laughs> Are you offended? Question mark? <laughs> Every time we offend E-Rich in the chat, we should just send that to him. I know, he, he'll, he'll know it. He'll just not scroll down. I mean, e Rich has spent about a decade on 4chan, so I almost guarantee he already knows about it. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah, show it to your kids. It's a rite of passage. You don't get to turn 10 years old in this household until you scroll <laughs> to the bottom. I don't know. I don't think it has the same impact on children. They don't realize <laughs> what? what all the stuff is. I don't know. I, don't, I think you could scar a child for life. Eh. Carson, don't link to that shit in the chat. What are you doing? Is she modded? <laughs> yeah, she's modded. Oh, no. Everich doesn't go on 4chan anymore. I think he stopped like two years ago. Is it too alt-right for him? <laughs> I assume so. Damn. This is what got Trump elected. Can't go there anymore. 4chan got him elected. Supposedly. I mean, is that is that was M, what M. Plemmer's video said, or was it just memes? Hmm. Uh, he talked about how Trump harnessed the power of memes to uh, to push his campaign, but I don't think it was really about 4chan. Uh, I guess it's more like the 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 left saying it's 4chan. Hmm. And those the anonymous English. Nazi boards. <laughs> So, what's the day in the life of Florian? You just woke up. What are you going to do with the rest of your day? This? Oh, well, I'm I'm probably going to have a pizza. <laughs> going to go to the store. <laughs> you get have the same pizza every fucking day. 
Well, sometimes I order it, sometimes I, I have a frozen pizza. It's different. <laughs> you eat anything other than pizza? <laughs> oh, Wait, is yeah, that your, sure. your plan for the day is at one point I will eat a pizza? Well, that point's pretty soon, man. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, everybody plans on eating lunch every day. I don't know if that's really a big plan. I mean, it'll be probably the next thing I do once we stop. But yeah, I guess I'll. You're gonna go I'll get a pizza at at eight in the morning. Yes. How hungry are yeah, I've you? I've been up for like two hours already. So it's pizza time. <laughs> sure is. What the fuck? <laughs> so what are you gonna do after you eat the pizza? It's gonna be like twenty minutes of your day. Twenty minutes of what? Of your day. What do you do after the oh, pizza? Boy. Well, I don't know. Probably do some work. Get, an play get some another games. pizza. And now just one today. Get a cheese pizza from Comet Ping Pong Pizza. <laughs> cheese pizza? That sounds pretty unimaginary. <laughs> the buddy on Google and tell me he doesn't look like a hairless E Rich. Okay, if you insist, I guess we'll have to take a look. Oh god, the buddy. Is that the, the, <laughs> the, the TikTok guy? <laughs> I don't know if it looks like E Rich, but it's funny looking. <laughs> Wait, he's a, he's a predator on TikTok? I think so. He's like, what, he's like making TikToks to little kids and shit? No, he, he reacts to them, I guess. It, like, you, you do them side by side, and then it's a it's a cute kid, and then he's being pervy on the other side. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. <laughs> Florian is just... our guy. <laughs> Elf. You're what, their what? guy. No, you're their guy. I'm the guy. Yeah, you're their well, guy. I think I, I heard from, about the buddy from the right opinion, so I guess never mind. He now, might is it called the right opinion him. because he has, like, like a politically right opinion or, like, his opinion is correct? Didn't you talk to him at some point? I don't think so. Maybe. Hmm. I don't think I did. Why do I associate him with you? Huh. Nah, he's, he, he's fairly liberal. Oh, okay, so it's like, this is the correct opinion. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it might have been a pun. <laughs> nope. Well. Well, unless I'm I'm crazy. Hmm. Potential wasted. Could, could he be secretly dog whistling? Hmm. Well, wasted? Maybe he, he stole it from the right, the right wings. <laughs> could be. Anything's Fighting possible. Fight. And people are just looking up the right opinion, trying to find Nazi stuff. But no, it's not that. It's just some guy talking about internet stuff. It's a re drama. reverse dog whistle. It's just a whistle. <laughs> oh no. That's pretty good. You'll never see it coming. <laughs> Unless you're looking for it. Well, I guess everyone hears it coming. It's, yeah. uh, it's a regular yeah, whistle. It's not just the dog. <laughs> yeah. I don't like the phrase dog whistle. Are we, are we implying that dogs are racist? Rude. Dogs are not well, racist. Dogs are obviously racist. My dog has never barked at anybody. You have a dog? No. <laughs> dogs have so many races, man. How could they not be racist? Actually, I guess they... I guess they have sex with any race. Hmm, never mind. You, know what, you mean like dogs are racist against each other, not against humans? <laughs> Yeah. Racist. Well, I don't know. Maybe they're racist against humans too. Who could tell? Well, I suppose they they just take the racist bias of their owners if they if that exists. There's an episode of King of the Hill about that where oh yeah, Hank needs to get something repaired and Ladybird starts barking at the black repairman, so everybody thinks that Hank is racist. But it turns out Lady Bird is only barking at him because Hank doesn't like repairmen because he likes to do everything by himself. <laughs> so it's, yeah. just, it's just a horrible misunderstanding. But the whole town yeah. thinks that he's racist. Yeah, he only hates this whole vocation of people. Because well, he, because <laughs> he's so proud and he wants to be the man who fixes it himself. <laughs> yeah, pretty crazy. I thought it was a great episode. I think yeah, I think Chris Rock. No, Bernie Mac. Bernie Mac is the voice of the repairman. <laughs> nice. And oh now man, he's I, dead. I still haven't seen that that interview you did with the with Dale Gribble. Oh, that'll be great oh, yeah, to the, watch. The Dale Gribble interview is a lot of fun. You should you can oh, watch man. that while you eat your pizza. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> 
Oh, that seems more like a, a background thing to listen to, but yeah. maybe. <laughs> well, he, he plays the knife game, so you might want to watch that part. Holy shit. Wow. Is he a Rusty Cage? Who could have known? Yeah, Rusty Cage is also in the interview. Really? Yeah, it's all three of us. Wow. He should challenge him to a knife game, or is that what happened? Uh, kind of. <laughs> kind <laughs> you of. need to compete. <laughs> yeah, I'm close enough. Beautiful. Wow, that, that really must be worth watching then. <laughs> yeah, I, I had the time of my life. I, uh, I'd i love to have him on again, and it sounds like he Damn. wants to. Wow. Well, that, that's pretty good. Man, his responses to you were pretty crazy. <laughs> pretty yeah. hard to watch. Yeah, he's a fun guy. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, what, what great times. <laughs> yep, one of these days I'll look back at uh, my YouTube channel and my Twitch channel and think, man, those were the glory days. Those were the good <laughs> old days. I can only imagine what depressive slum I'm stuck in that these days are thought back of as the good ones. But it's gonna you happen. maniac with your self-fulfilling prophecies. Always expecting the worst and getting it. <laughs> Every fucking time. <laughs> <laughs> Every time. Oh, you just gotta believe. You gotta, you gotta let God in, you know? Oh, yeah, that'll <laughs> fix all my problems. I think the next, will. the next depression chamber should just be me talking about my life. <laughs> Here's my life story from the day I was born. Born oh, no. on 713. <laughs> lucky and unlucky. Paradoxical birthday. Unfortunately, it seems only the unlucky half of my birthday seems to interfere with my life etc etc you're gonna be full twisted world huh <laughs> yep <laughs> I, my world has never been so twisted <laughs> damn yeah especially <laughs> yeah. now <laughs> <laughs> at least I'll always have Florian and Erich they'll never punch their girlfriend <laughs> in the face they can't even get them oh other no than, other than Erich of course hmm yeah Oh, maybe maybe Erich will will do something like punch her by accident because there's a fly on her or something. <laughs> or uh, <laughs> he'll he'll deny letting her uh, have sex with a bull for the third time that evening, <laughs> and she'll hit him. Oh no, he'll get kicked by the bull. <laughs> oh, whoa! Because <laughs> he he refuses to grab the bull by the horn, if you know what I'm saying. <laughs> yeah, they like that when you do that. <laughs> they really do. I would know from experience. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey, you know, dribbling. <laughs> Rapid fire winking at the camera. <laughs> oh, jeez. How much does Erich's girlfriend weigh? I don't know. I've never seen her. Man, I, I need to know. <laughs> I bet you're all wondering how I got myself into this situation. It all started on 713. <laughs> lucky and unlucky. The paradox of my life. And yet, only the bad luck besmirched my ma you start using a bunch of uh highbrow words that don't make sense in the sentence because i want to sound smart but then i just sound even more dumb what on earth could you mean by besmirched oh no <laughs> i guess we'll have to google that one the the, the, the tragic backstory seconds you know what's funny somebody skunky in the chat might be right uh what if erich does not actually have a girlfriend and he's just using her as an excuse to not hang out with us all the time. Yeah, secretly it's just breaking his diet and having huge pizza parties. Whoa! What is he at? Your house with all this pizza? Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, we're both doing it. <laughs> wow. I knew you were inviting you, Rich, over and not me. You. Yeah. We're gonna gang up on you and sumo wrestling to death. <laughs> oh, God, you guys are gonna sandwich <laughs> me between your bellies. <laughs> But uh, yeah, we've never doomed. we've never seen any physical evidence of Erich having a girlfriend. It very well could be that he is lying to seem cool and to uh, I guess play more D and D without us knowing. Well, I gotta you know, I gotta it's... sign back into my Facebook and look at his profile and see if he has a girlfriend because surely he would post <laughs> about her on there. Oh damn! Well, you know it's the the quantum girlfriend. You can't know if she's there and, and she exists at the same time because if you check, then she'll be offended and then she'll leave. <laughs> Schrodinger's girlfriend. 
All right. All right. I'm no, signed no, in. I'm clicking on the E Rich account. Moment of truth, people. There better be a selfie <laughs> with his girlfriend. Um, no, no. Yeah, dox mm. him live on here. Be great. <laughs> This is fucking bullshit. Yeah, maybe you've been streaming your your, your your desktop the entire time. This motherfucker, there's no picture with a girl on here. <gasps> what kind of man has a girlfriend and does not post one picture on Facebook? He's retweeted ten things in the last day about the Oscars. No picture of his fucking <laughs> girlfriend. This is some bullshit. I think he's lying. It says it says on his profile in a relationship. It doesn't say with who. It's all lies. Oh man. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> Where's the girlfriend, E. Rich? I will go through all 559 of your friends until I find the one that has a picture with you. Oh man, could it be that she's one of those hermits who don't who don't use the internet? Hmm. Could be she doesn't exist. Oh, how could you say that? There's a picture of E. Rich and his mom. Does that count? Is that <laughs> sure. A, could that be his girlfriend? <laughs> He wouldn't understand. That's what's wrong. That's why he can't show you. Wait, you know his mom? Hmm. I don't know his mom. He's, it says, here's a picture of me and my mommy. That's what he put on his Facebook. Is it a sugar mommy? <laughs> I, I don't know. She looked kind of <laughs> old. <laughs> well, what do you expect? <laughs> you think he's just going to have a young, hot girlfriend? That's Ridiculous. Wouldn't that be the funniest twist of all time if he was like dating a 20 year old supermodel and she was super hot and super cool and rich and shit? Yeah, then she finds out about you and leaves him immediately. What, for you? No, because she wants some of that binding offended. of Isaac money! <laughs> oh no. Yeah, she's only wanting to be. She only wanted to get to me, that's all. Yeah, you'll be like, ah, oh, no, my pizza fund! Ah! <laughs> give me back my Isaac money! I was gonna buy pizza with that! How can I afford pizza now? Damn. Probably, probably the richest person I know eats fucking frozen pizza every day. You could, you could buy a steak and a lobster. You could, you could eat so many things, Florian. Why? Fro frozen pizza isn't cheap. What? It's like a dollar. Really? Wow. Yeah. What do you buy a, a thirty dollar frozen pizza over there? What? <laughs> Eighty euros over there? <laughs> How much well, is a frozen I, pizza? I don't like wasting money anyways, but, but e you know, eating, a steak needs e to be prepared. Eating a food that is not a frozen pizza every day is not a waste of money. <laughs> you gotta have well, other food. Well, well, it's more of an addiction with the pizza. <laughs> That's a, it's a very strange addiction. You should go on that show. <laughs> what strange addiction is yeah, that a show? My strange addiction is a show. Damn. Um, uh, that's pretty cool. Do you have any cooking prowess, or are you the same as me, where I can't cook anything? Eh, uh, well, I guess I can cook a little bit. Of, it's not great, though. Well, like a peanut butter and jelly sandwich. Do they have peanut butter over there? I'm told South America does not have peanut butter. Do you have it? Yeah, we have it. I don't know if we have jelly. What? Well, jam? Hmm. Well, we do have jam, but is that yeah. the same? Probably not. Uh, no, I think it's the same. Really? Yeah. Damn. I guess I never knew. Yeah. Wow, I could have made PB and J this entire time. <laughs> I, I eat it all the time. I like it. Really, it doesn't seem like it would be good, but I guess I should try it. You've never tried a PB and J? No. What? Come, what well, did, maybe. Were, were you ever a child? <laughs> Dude, this isn't a typical thing children eat here. Uh, well, I guess I don't know. I guess I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> if you have peanut butter and jam, there's no excuse. Your mother was uh, well, horrible to you. You should I, ask. I never you really. Sue her. I never really buy peanut butter. Yeah, if you don't eat Seems... PB and J, I don't know what you would use it for. I know what the hell would anyone use it for? Toast. Why don't you, what do you why put why on you toast? Have... Uh, well, I try to not eat too much toast, but I guess I I put avocado and eggs sometimes. Yeah, well. There you go. I mean, yeah, buying bread sucks because it goes bad in like three days. It's like, well, I guess I'll, I'll eat this whole loaf of bread in three days <laughs> by myself. Great. Well, toast bread doesn't go bad that fast. Well, hmm. 
And if it's past the expiration date, I don't even want to fuck with it. Oh, yeah, no, I, I only... I only worry about it if it's actually moldy. Carson wants to know what kids... What do kids actually eat where you're from? <laughs> if, if a kid is bitching... Oh, man. Here, here you would give him a PB&J, you would give him uh, SpaghettiOs, you would give him <laughs> macaroni and cheese. What do kids eat in Austria? Oh, man. Uh, I, I guess I... I don't even know. What? The, 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 yeah, the, I had this childhood friend, but he always ate, ate like weird American food, so I don't know. Well, like a hot dog? <laughs> well, I guess he made he, he made these crazy American sandwiches and stuff. Well, like what? Turkey and lettuce and tomato? Some crazy shit? <laughs> BLT? Yeah, sure. Fucking crazy, dude. <laughs> yeah, bizarre, isn't it? <laughs> well, I don't know. I, I grew up with my... <laughs> my grandparents and they, they would make like really old school stuff make obviously. you eat like liver for breakfast <laughs> not for breakfast <laughs> <laughs> that's just like some just a slice of bread with, with, with jam or something no, with know, nothing just good. dried toast <laughs> <laughs> here you go Florian oh, well. <laughs> oh no they, they they were really into into I, I guess greasy and, and, and good food <laughs> Skumkey wants to know, Florian, are you jealous of the glorious country to the east? To the what? To the east of you. Ah, jeez. Where is east? <laughs> yeah, east, a.k.a. right. <sighs> Holy shit. I, how am I forgetting what country is there? Oh, my God. My guess would be Germany, just based off of this being no, a no. joke. No, Germany's north. Oh, okay. What's to the east? I could tell you which countries to the east of America well, pretty Hungary. fast. Yeah, I know. Oh, Hungary? Wait, yeah, the, the ocean. <laughs> yeah, the ocean. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's definitely you countries. Let's let's find out. What about Come Lunchables? On. Do kids eat Lunchables over in Germany or in Austria? Mm, no, you guys, you guys have so. kid cuisine? We, we don't have most of those brands, I guess. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is Hungary and Slovenia and, and Czechia and Croatia. Uh, who knew? Yeah, I mean, I, I keep I keep confusing those, so I guess that's crazy. Holy shit, I, Google Maps is, is, a, is a globe. Uh, weird. <laughs> How many uh, countries in the EU have you been to? <laughs> oh, not that many. I've and, been to and the the Germany, Italy, the United Kingdom and... doesn't count anymore. I uh, I've never been there actually. Oh, well. oh yeah, I guess I was in Swa in France as well. So I guess those are all of them. <laughs> are those uh, oh, and, close? And Netherlands ones. Germany, Italy, France, Netherlands. Yeah, that's hey, it. Hey, yeah, Netherlands. We still got to meet up in uh, Amsterdam. <laughs> No. Yeah, smoke it up. Yeah, yeah. I'll get hookers and you'll get you get weed. Great. Sure. Yeah, I'm down. <laughs> no, I'll get hookers too. I don't give a fuck. Once you're in Amsterdam, oh, everything else uh, disappears. Oh. Yeah, that's right. You, you'll even get hookers for sheep, right? No, she's not invited. <laughs> oh no. No. Well, what about your your fantasy of having a threesome? Hmm. Yeah, with I'm you a... with you and Erich. <laughs> Oh, that was the it. fantasy. Jeez, <laughs> you really can't think of what food children in your country eat. <laughs> Have you ever uh, been yeah, outside? No, I'm, I'm so far divorced from children right now. I don't even know. <laughs> you were married to a child and got divorced. <laughs> oh my god! Yes. Sure. Whoa! That that makes so much sense. Call sure. TMZ. Famous game designer Florian Imsel married to a child. <laughs> Maybe I was a child. You maniac. <laughs> child divorce. <laughs> oh no. Are children allowed to get a divorce? Hmm. Are children allowed to get married? <laughs> well, not here, but they might get married somewhere else. Uh, I think anybody who's married is allowed to get a divorce, typically. If you live in a freedom country. Well, I guess so. Waterman wants to know has Florian ever been a child? No. <laughs> <laughs> I think you came out of the womb looking like you do now. Well, I looked like a child, but I was never a child at heart. <laughs> wow. <laughs> well, growing up in uh, in the 
the wasted remains of World War II. It hardened your soul so quickly. <laughs> As if. Oh, man. <laughs> you were born in uh, 89, right? 88. 88. Wow, you're a true 80s kid, not a 90s kid. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Uh, what did you, you went and saw Back to the Future 2 the year it premiered? You were one years old. <laughs> sure. Wow. Awesome. I didn't. I don't remember it though. <laughs> yeah, the other patrons must have been very angry with your parents for taking you in there. <laughs> yeah. No, you didn't cry. You were always an, an adult, even as a baby. Oh yeah, you're right. <laughs> you were the boss baby in real life. <laughs> yes. You, you're a fan of Boss Baby, if I recall, right? You watched the whole cartoon. Yeah, well, I, I guess we stopped because because Meat Man didn't watch any more of it. The traitor. <laughs> watch it without him. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> I prefer watching things that I get to podcast about. <laughs> <laughs> Just do a solo podcast about the Boss Baby cartoon. <laughs> oh no. I can't be funny by myself. Oh, why would you be funny? I want to hear a real review of the Boss Baby cartoon. <laughs> <laughs> hmm. Oh yes, the the economic state of the babies is is very tragic. <laughs> All right, it's almost two a.m. here. I know you want to go buy a pizza. I want to stop being on the internet, so I think we should call it a stream. What do you say? Yeah, let's let's call it a stream. All righty, I'll <laughs> talk to you. <laughs> I'll talk to you later, Florian. Goodbye. See you. And to all of you watching at home. Also goodbye. It's been fun. Not looking forward to doing this 24-hour stream in a couple days. I'm actually uh, quite upset. I didn't think this would happen. I thought it was all a meme. And once again, my own memes are coming back to bite me. Fucking kill me, fam.